spring cleaning part one because my house is a mess. Starting with the mini fridge, let's restock it. First, we're filling the mini bottles. Green Gatorade, I'm gonna try my best to pour it nicely. Berry. Smaller ones will have coconut water. Those are going on the middle shelf. Now I'm gonna fill the mini containers. Fruit snacks. And gushers. And the bigger ones will hold fruit. Grapes. Raspberries. Blackberries. Strawberries. Those are going on the bottom shelf. Strawberry soda is going up here. Can't forget the lunch bowls and Capri Sun because I'm a whole child. Charcuterie bites, is that how you say it? The door has the coconut water. Poppy. Mochi in the freezer. And that's pretty much it. I give it a week. Spring cleaning my entire house part two. The pantry. First I'm taking everything out, which won't take me long because all I have is seasoning and cereal. Wow, it looks the same. Now I'm going to wipe it all down. Should I? No. Yes. I shouldn't. My whole house is glowing at this point. Now I'm going to plan everything out. I really want a pasta section. I don't even know how to make pasta. Just kidding, mom, if you're watching this. Cereal. I'm going to put all my spices on this thing. These are going here. These bucket things are going on this shelf. I'm also putting these tray things on top. Rice, flour, sugar, pancake mix, a refresher section. Lastly, these buckets up here. Now I'm going to stock everything, but I need to go grocery shopping. I'm going shopping tonight, but can you guys help me make a pantry grocery list? Tag me, DM me, whatever works. But I need help. I'll be right back. See you in the restock video. Yo, what up? Anyone else feel like cups have been giving grandma's couch? Karen's kitchen towels? Casino floor? Until today, look how cute these are. These ones color change. Let me get some ice. Okay, what? The water looks blue. And red, wow. Found the triangle cup. I'm actually gonna use it. This one looks like a disco ball. It's so cute. This one is so cute until you turn it around. I'm gonna keep it facing forward. This one's my favorite right now. The straw, the texture, everything. Look at this masterpiece. It's beautiful. This reminds me of the Very Berry Hibiscus Refresher. Summer 2023, maybe. Please bring it back. I got this one in Florida. It's perfection. Lastly, this one, the straw. Oh my god. And this one. Eee, it's so cute. And that's pretty much it. Now I'm gonna put everything away. Yo, what up? I've never had a snack drawer, so I'm gonna try and make one. First, I'm filling the mini containers. Mini m &Ms. These are so good. Sour Patch Kids. And Cocoa Pebbles. This is so cute. Now I'm going to fill the bigger ones. First, Oreos. Blue Takis. And Cheez-Its. Oh. Now I'm going to fill the even bigger containers. Anyone else like to snack on waffle cones? This one's going to have fruit snacks. And fruit strips. So excited. Time to put everything in my nightstand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I can properly binge watch Love Island. Goodbye. Yo, what up? I'm at Coachella. I'm going to try and make one of those get ready stations. I think they're so cute. And this table is perfect. First, the hair section. Next, body makeup. All the other makeup's going in the middle. We have the lip section. Screenshot, these are all my favorites. Blush. Base makeup. I don't this has like primer, concealer, all that. Eye makeup. This section has eyebrows too. Contour. Brushes and highlighter. Last section's gonna have perfume. Favorite makeup wipes. And jewelry. I got this on Amazon. When you open it, there's like a mirror. Necklaces go behind the mirror. It's so cute. And that's pretty much it. I love it so much. It's so perfect. I'm posting all my outfits on IG, so if you want to see them, just in case, you can go there. <laughs> Bye! Yo, what up? I'm gonna try and make a that girl igloo. I don't know how it's still snowing in April, but look at this. <laughs> I did that. Okay, so first I'm building the base. I've never done this before. Maybe I should look it up. It's going good so far. Okay, I think I'm giving up here. I'm gonna try and make a giant snowball. This is what it looks like so far. Now I'm gonna make my niece push it around. Just kidding, she's making me push it. Taking a break and going upstairs. Just gotta clear the last one. Okay, we made it. We're on top of the pool. <laughs> okay, so we gotta be this big. This looks good. Oh! Get my hair. <laughs> oh, not anymore. Sit on it. Whoa, look. Yo, what up? I have a problem. <laughs> Don't remember what half of this is, but that's probably the half I bought at 3 a.m. Let's start with Road. I actually do know what's in here. Everything was finally in stock, so I bought it without thinking. These are so cute. I'm really hoping these are actually good. If not, I kept my receipt. Next pack, son. I saw Charlie D'Amelio wearing these, and I thought they were so cute. So much better in person. These were so cute. No idea what this is, but watch what I can do. I discovered I can open packages with my nails. <laughs> I forgot about this one. It's an ice roller, a peach fuzz remover, and a sleeping bag to hold everything. How could I leave this in my cart? Lululemon. Is it just me, or is this bag really creepy? That's going back to Lululemon. What is this? Love the new mod perfume, so I got the travel size. This is one of my favorite skincare brands. I'll probably use this for the rest of my life. I got some new things, but I'm pretty much just restocking. Flared leggings from Pop Flex. Every piece I get from them is such good quality. White Fox, of course. Look how cute this set is. I have an addiction to White Fox. I can't help it. Their stuff is so cute. I'm wearing this set tomorrow. Wonder what I got, Hazel. Heart shaped pants. Pancakes, food scoop with a clip. See you in part two. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. I don't even know what Stony Clover Lane is, but I saw an outfit before it dropped and I had to go get it because I mean, come on. first this cooler, yeah. Kelly, you name me. And that's why I bought it. Dog toy leash and bandana for Hazel. Okay, hold on. I think she likes it. This cute paddle set. I found these patches and duffel bag. I'm gonna put them on right now. There we go. I guess you just stick them on. Oh my gosh. Wait. I'm doing cherries for the fifth time. I can't get it centered. I feel like it's I think I got it. I don't know. But anyways, I got this bag too. It's so cute. Next, this clear backpack and a beach bag. Sandals and a beach towel. Lastly, these cups. The straws are heart shaped. And I got a charm set. I feel like I need a new routine. I can't keep doing this. I don't understand how the time changes so fast. Like, I feel like I've only been standing here for a minute. That's probably my sign to go. Part two, I'm gonna fill these with dried fruit. First, strawberries, bananas, raspberries, blueberries, mango, and cherries. I'm gonna put them on these shelves I got off Amazon. I'm gonna put everything on my Amazon storefront, by the way. Anyways, let's fill these. This one's gonna have crushed Oreos. This one's gonna have chocolate chips. 
you can twist these and everything comes out so easy. That's why my favorite toppings are in them. Putting the chocolate and caramel drizzle up here. Put some tea down here. Now I'm gonna put the sprinkles in rainbow order. OG approved, except that's pink. Lastly, I put these lollipops in this mushroom cup. Now let's make some soda and ice cream. This is my favorite thing I've ever made. Too bad I have to pack it up. And I have to pack my pantry because I got my keys to my new place. So yeah. Um, yeah, I can explain. I had to push everything that way so it wouldn't look as bad, but that did not work. So I'm going to try and reset my entire closet. First, I'm taking everything out. I'm going to have to sleep on the couch. I already know. Okay, this side is great. That side. Oh my God. Okay, it's finally empty. Now I'm going to make a keep and donate pile. I kept some of this because of the memory, so I'm going to try really hard to let those go. Okay, I'm finally done. This is what I'm keeping. And the donate pile is over there. I really want to pick stuff out, but I just never wear them, so I'm hoping someone else can enjoy them, but I'm going to miss them. Why am I like this? Before I put it all back, I have an idea for this closet. Putting in new lights everywhere, and I bought a bunch of organizing stuff. Most of it gets here tomorrow, so I'll see you in part two. Part four, I'm putting these bins on the top shelf. I'm going to fill those last, but I spaced them out better. Now I'm putting my favorite bags on this shelf. Next, I'm filling the main part of the closet, which will clear up at least the bed. I tried color coding, kinda. Let's just see if it looks good. First, my shirt, hoodies, sweatshirts, and crop tees. How oh, is this my closet right now? It doesn't feel real. It's so pretty so far. Da -da 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 -da. This side's gonna be my casual comfy side. Just made that up. I basically more sets. Putting my leggings on the shelf. I'm using the shelf divider to separate flared and regular. I'm also putting bodysuits here because those are comfy. That's it for this side, but what do I put here? The other side's gonna hold my dressier clothes. I think I'll put all my bottoms on these. Shorts, pants, sets, everything else. That's pretty much it. I'm going to Vegas in a few hours for my birthday. I'll do the bins when I come back. Actually, when we get back, because you're coming with me. Yo, what up? I'm going to try and make a get well basket for Courtney. She's sick, and since I can't be there, I'm hoping this helps. First slippers and a blanket. She wrote out notes for the last gift she gave me. So, of course, I'm doing the same for her. Next, a mug and tea. Okay, but this mug is so cute. The notes. Next, a candle. And a key plan to keep by her nightstand. Courtney loves coffee, but what if it was delivered? Things that help me when I feel sick. This one, she gets bored. Got one too. We'll see how that goes. Goldfish, her favorite snack thought everything would fit i'll just put everything else in the box stuff i thought was cute but also funny <laughs> lastly she does mystery unboxings that's what everything else is for she probably already has the mystery stuff we'll see maybe not just decorated the box it's so cute now i'm gonna send it to her and yeah yo what up i made it to vegas for my birthday so let's set up the hotel room first i'm laying out my makeup isn't this bag so cute you can actually hang it up forever 21 don't know if they sell it anymore but if they do you need one Anytime I travel, these are my makeup must haves. Also, there's a whole bench in the shower. I just bumped into that and now my hair is wet. I was gonna say, I don't think I've ever had a hotel room this big. I'm very proud of myself. The only clothes I packed are in here. I'm an overpacker, so this feels very off. This is us. <laughs> Yo, what up? I'm sure you know what this is. First, I got this blanket for my couch. I've never had a weighted blanket before. This thing is so heavy. Or I'm just weak. It's really pretty. I love it. Next, I found this ring display. Let me just show you how cute this is. Hold on. I'm trying to organize my jewelry, so I also got one for bracelets. Cute. I'm excited. Next, I got me bare lamp. I have a collection of nightlights because I'm still afraid of the dark. I just get so claustrophobic in it. Anyways, this is cute. Next, I bought an organizer. Ziploc bag organizer. There's a theme with everything. I think I was in a cleaning mood. This 11-11 necklace. A Pisces necklace. And a wooble. I saw it on Shark Tank. Yeah, you can learn to crochet a penguin. Anyways, that's it. That's decorating my room part four. Coughing <laughs> helps my voice a little bit. Anyways, part four for decorating my room. My voice. Okay, I'm just gonna whisper. I bought a few things to add. First, these LED lights. I'm gonna put them on this wall. Drink some tea. My voice is feeling a little bit better. I'm gonna build this chair I got on Amazon. I'm screaming. I didn't realize how, sm <laughs> how small this was until it came in the mail. Basically, just bought a chair for my dog. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I also got this really cute side table. Look how cute this candle is. It's my birthday month. I like to celebrate my birthday all month long. It's horrible. I'm adding a self care jar because I'm sick. Snacks. This turned into a different video. And water. Everything is really cute so far. I love it. Especially the door. So cute. Anyways, bye guys. I'm going to sleep. Part three, it's very echoey in here. Anyways, I don't know what I'm doing. The only thing I know is how I want my shoes organized. So I'm starting there and I'm gonna wing everything else. First, I'm building all the shoe boxes. Really cool, they have a door. I wear a seven and a half, so my shoes are gonna look so small, but it's fine. Twelve more. Five more. I've been here for so long. Finally done. Now I'm gonna stack them along the wall. This looks so good. Sorry, I'm just so happy. I don't think I have enough, but we'll see. I brought most of my favorite ones, so let's put them in the boxes. Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Mama Bear. Just putting these on top for now. Definitely gonna need more boxes but it looks so good now i'm gonna organize my workout clothes i've always wanted a workout section so that's gonna be this side first i'm putting in these tension rods the workout sets are going here instead of well, i can't even talk 3 a.m again okay anyways i'm gonna hang these up just wow um, can't wait to finish everything else i'll see you in part yo what up i found more mini verse make a mini food ball so i'm gonna try and make more it was so much fun last time so let's see what i get this time so excited first i'm gonna open them the little ingredients are so cute it also comes with a recipe card and collection guide i will be needing that first i'm pouring the syrup on the bread bananas and blueberries i'm trying to use the mini tongs but it's not working out this is so cute now i'm gonna let it sit in the sun well that's there i'm gonna make a few more first mini boba look how cute the ice bag is ice first boba and milk tea oh my god i can't this one's my favorite one i'm gonna try and find the other colors so i can collect them look at the pink one. Oh my god i just made these two now i'm gonna make a milkshake oh it's a chocolate milkshake okay 
These mini chocolate bars are so cute. I'm really hoping this one is the berry refresher because I need to collect it. I got pineapple smoothie, still a good one. I think I did good. This is so cute. I'm gonna let these sit in the sun so the resin can cure. Oh my god. Okay, they're done. This was so much fun. Now I can add these to my collection. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try and make an at-home workout card. I'm so shy at the gym. I just feel like I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna figure it out here and maybe go back or not. Anyway, I'm gonna put everything in this acrylic cart. Top shelf is gonna hold protein bars. Someone said these are really good, so I'm excited to try them. I'll update you in the comments. Liquid IV in the back. This side is gonna hold resistance bands. Lastly, a water bottle in the back. It doesn't look that great, but oh well. Next shelf is gonna hold hair ties. Hair clips. Yoga block. Lemmy matcha. Lemmy deep glow. These are really good to massage your muscles. This waist trainer is so good. I'll link it on my Amazon storefront. Ropeless jump rope. You can jump rope without hitting anything. More yoga stuff. Lastly, body glow. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm so excited to use it. It's so cute. Part three, it's finally dry. Now I'm gonna paint it. I'm cleaning the dust with a blow dryer. Not the best idea. I still haven't decided on the color, but we're gonna do purple for now. Okay, I love the purple. I think I'll keep it. Now I'm gonna let this dry and then glue it on the mirror. You know what comes after that. Bringing it up the stairs by myself, I can do this. Okay, I was able to stand it up. I can't wait to show you what it looks like. I didn't mean to make this thing so heavy. It is so heavy, but four steps down, all of those to go. Oh my gosh, I'm sweating. I made it, you guys. It's up. It's there. And it's not broken. Now I'm gonna put these LED lights behind it. I'm just gonna get to the point. This is the mirror. I don't know how to describe this. It's so much better in person. Single number one when you walk in. This is what my YouTube channel will see. It's just so pretty. I love it so much. <laughs> so worth it. That looks disgusting right now. What the fuck? It's so beautiful. <laughs> okay, bye. Part two, I'm gonna try and make spackle art for the wall above my bed. Should I do this in the garage? Yes, no. Yes. Covered the couch, so it's fine. I hope. Drew up my design so I don't mess up. Now I'm supposed to mix this. Hope I don't mess this up. Okay, it's flat. This is actually really fun. And okay, now I'm gonna use this to make the wave. I almost fell on this corner. I'm gonna hurry and do the top now. I feel like I'm decorating a cake. Okay, this will turn white when it dries. I'm gonna work on the second one now. Let's look past the dump site I just made and look how cute these are. Now I'm gonna let them dry before I paint them, so yeah, I'll be right back. My brother left a fake cockroach in my drawer. I was planning on moving it, but now that I'm moving it, as if you're my brother, I'm coming for you. I might be right behind you. Aren't you scared? Put paper towels on top of it so I wouldn't have to look at it. Wow! I'm mad right now! Can you see that thing? It's huge. Put double sided tape on the Swiffer. I don't wanna touch anything that's touching it. Just Swiffer. I'm not touching that. I don't think I can do this. Genuinely, I don't think I can do this. Kelly, come on. Pick it up and pretend it's not there. Pretend I don't see it. Throw the whole thing away. Okay. Got it. I've been scaring Kelly all afternoon with this fake roach in her room. <laughs> She's downstairs not even paying attention. Went ahead and I planted this little roach right here. Hopefully, she comes in here to do her next video. She will come across that thing and freak out. Payback for the for the cricket. Part two, I'm so excited. I have to take it all down because my lights broke. It's all over here now. Do I just leave it there and go to sleep? Yes, no, yeah. I feel like I'm gonna be here all night. Now I'm putting on the new ones. This looks so good. I'm gonna put the rope light up now. I'm doing the same paint drop thing like last time. I think that looks good. Oh yeah. Yeah. I can finally put the cups back. This is gonna look so good. so good so this is with the lights on and the lights off next i'm gonna finish decorating my room i have to make nightstands anyways i'll see you in that video part two i bought clip you guys told me to get sandpaper so i did and it's so smooth finally done now i'm just cleaning it tape is on now i'm gonna paint the whole thing white i'm only worried about the clay part wait this looks so good do i use the clay yes no yes no should i use the clay i need to move the mirror so i'm gonna trace a line around it Oh, well, there's no going back now. Okay, okay, the first rope is done. Now I have to shape it to the black line. If this actually works, I didn't take ceramics for nothing. Oh my gosh, okay, Kelly, okay. I'm gonna let this dry and then somehow pick it up and put it on the mirror. What color do I paint this? I was thinking this one, but no, I don't know. I'll see you in part three. Redecorating my beauty slash filming room part four. I finally have all the things I need to paint. And Starbucks with my own eyes because the girl didn't put enough. I'm painting my entire room, so I need to get all of this stuff out. I'm gonna shove as much as I can in the closet. I just took out the big mirror and I'm finally getting rid of this stinking shelf. I put all the stuff that was on it on this shelf. This is only temporary. I have a plan and I cannot wait to show you how I'm gonna organize my makeup and skincare. Oh, it's gonna be a dream come true. There's tape on my floor. I'm almost done. I just need to take out this drawer and this one. I just have to take down this wallpaper. a lot harder than I thought it was going to be, but I'm almost done. I brought up all of the things I needed to paint, now I'm just taping up the edges of the molding and the ceiling. This is the color I chose, it's a light gray, and I'm so in love with it. Here's the first coat! Oh my gosh, my voice! <laughs> first coat on all the walls except this one which i'm going to start in a minute i'm so excited for part five but it's going to be delayed by a few days because the organizers i ordered are not here yet we love it yo what up i was going to try and unpack my room and glow recipe invited me to malibu so i'm going to do that instead oh my gosh we're here 
This is the table. Um, I got this beautiful drink. Why do I want my house to look like this now? Wow, the vitamin C eye cream. Oh my god. First course looks good. Pork, egg, dinner. Dessert is here. I'm so excited. Oh, they come really good. Gosh, the view is amazing. Now I'm gonna grab a gift bag. Super cute. Thank you, Girl Recipe. I'm home now. Broke two nails. Time to unpack my filming group. I'm tired. Two days left. It's fine. Everything's fine. Let's put up the tree. What do you think? It's giving my life right now. I'm kidding. I'm so. I'm gonna try to make a cloud themed tree. So these are the raindrops, you know. Now I'm gonna stick this white garland around the tree. And the white ornaments are mini clouds. I actually got a tree topper this year. Okay, whoa. I didn't know it did that. That's really cool. I had to turn my flash on because the lighting is so bad, but now I'm adding this white fluffy tree skirt. The last thing I need is Hazel's paw print. One pod at a time. This was hers last year. They're the same, but it's fine. It gets dark so quick, but this is what it looks like at night time. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Next up, I'm going to try and wrap gifts as that girl. So I moved back into my room, so part three of the mirror will be up soon. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Literally just wearing them on my feet. These flower things, but I don't think you understand. They go in your vent, so now my car is cute and stuff. Cow print pillow covers. These bins for like skincare, they're so small and I thought they were cute, you know? I finally got a sunset lamp. Expect this to be in every single video I do for the rest of my life, thank you. So everything I just showed you is on my Amazon page under 3 a.m. purchases. Also, update on the mirror, there is no update. I bought clay though, just I'll see you in part. Yo, what up? I've always wanted a boba bar, so I'm gonna try and make one. It's also gonna be a smoothie bar, I'm so excited. First, I'm filling the mini containers. Forgot to get a funnel, so this is gonna be really messy. Next, dragon fruit powder. RIP to my Billie Eilish hoodie, I'm gonna cry. Matcha, acai berry powder, chia seeds, and hemp seeds. These are going on the bottom. Time for the boba, I'm putting them in these containers. First, lychee, taro, black sugar, and golden tapioca. These are going up here, this looks so good. Now I'm gonna fill the bigger ones, I'm so excited for the honeydew mix. Taro, strawberry, and honeydew, this smells so good. Last one's gonna have oats for the smoothies. Now I'm gonna fill this cute honey jar. Disco drink stirs on this side. That's pretty much it. It's so cute. Next, I'll try and make one. Yo, what up? I should be packing, but I'm gonna make an ice cream and soda bar instead. First, I'm filling the sprinkles. This one's gonna be pink. Found Craig the flamingo sprinkles, so I'm mixing those in too. Next, yellow and yellow stars. Purple, green, blue, and some flowers. This one's my favorite. So cute. Oh my gosh. And orange. I'm gonna put them on top of this clear tray. This is gonna be so cute. Now I'm gonna fill the bigger containers. First one's gonna have some granola, sour punch straws. And the last one's gonna hold the ice cream cones. Now I'm gonna put the sodas in these organizers. Got these syrups at Starbucks and they gave me pumps. I'm running out of time, clear shelves. Dried fruit. Well, I tried. I'll see you in part two. And then I'll pack my pantry, which I really don't want to. I'm putting part five. I'm gonna fill the bins now. Also, TikTok might be banned. Be sure to follow me on YouTube and Instagram. <laughs> I'm sure we'll be fine, but just in case, you know, you never know. First, I'm organizing my swimwear. Usually I have a pile for tops and bottoms, but now I'm gonna put each set in these mesh bags. Now I'm gonna put them in the bins. This is so much better, I could cry. It's gonna be so much easier to find my swimsuits now. Next bin's gonna hold my belt bags, sweatpants, shapewear, I tried folding it, I don't know. Extra bags, hats, almost done, I'm getting rid of the ladder. I found this acrylic stool on Amazon, that's going here. I'm short, so it's perfect. Lastly, a rug, that's pretty much it. This is what it looks like when I walk in. And here's a slow clip of the whole thing. Yup, that's it, I'm obsessed, I could cry. I've never had a clip this long. Anyways, I love it. I really wanna redo my office night. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. I literally suck at camping because I bring things like this, but it's fine. How is it almost 4 a.m.? I have to hurry and stock this. Next, graham crackers. Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Papa Bear. I didn't know how else to organize the marshmallows, so I'm putting them in these Ziploc bags. Look how perfect these fit in here. Ready? I also got this. It's supposed to help you make the perfect s'more, so that's going to go on the side. Yep, that's basically it. My camping trip also just got canceled. Good thing I got a s'mores roast. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Well, if you only have one bag this time, and that's because all the other cups were not it, but this one. How cute it is. Oh my gosh. It's my new favorite. I know I say that a lot, but okay, this one, it looks normal, right? Bam, portal. <laughs> I was craving peeps, and then I don't know what happened after that. It's inflating. I love peeps. I'm gonna cry. Mostly because it's almost 4 a.m., but still, it's so cute. Pretty sure it goes outside, but I'm gonna keep it in my living room. Anyways, I got a desk and a few things for it, so I'm gonna be setting that up next, so I will see you tomorrow. You know what I was going to paint my spackler, but then I forgot I was going to Vegas for JBL Fest, so here I am. Okay, okay. I'm here, and my feet hurt so bad. It's kind of late time. Oh, hey. At a restaurant called Tao, and they have all the necessities. I think it's really cute. Anyways, yeah, I gotta go back. Now we're at a Doja Cat concert, and look what I got. Well, now let's figure out how to get James in the suitcase. So, okay. James, the suitcase. I'll see you when I get back. Decorating my room part four. Coughing <laughs> helps my voice a little bit. Anyways, part four. Decorating my room. My voice. Okay, I'm just gonna whisper. I bought a few things to add. First, these LED lights. I'm gonna put them on this wall. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. I also bought one on my bathroom door. I drank some tea. My voice is feeling a little bit better. I'm gonna build this chair I got on Amazon. I'm screaming. I didn't realize how, sm <laughs> how small this was until it came in the mail. Basically, just bought a chair for my dog. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I also got this really cute side table. 
Look how cute this candle is. It's my birthday month. I like to celebrate my birthday all month long. It's horrible. I'm adding a self care jar because I'm sick. What's next? This turned into a different video. And water. Everything is really cute so far. I love it. Especially the door. So cute. Anyways, bye guys. I'm going to sleep. Yo, what up? I'm going to try and turn my new bathroom into a Christmas glow spot. It's time. That's when I stopped the video. Anyways, pay. First, I'm painting my shower doors. Hopefully, this comes off in a month. Just kidding, it will because TikTok told me it would. <laughs> Help. Okay, what do you guys think? I try to make it look like snow in a window. I also got a mini Christmas tree for the bathroom. Let's decorate it. Please enjoy this ASMR bath. Simple but so cute. Time for the lights. Okay, ready? The best thing about these lights? They change color. Can't decide. Tree skirt? No tree skirt. They both look good. Found this mini star. I don't know if it ruins it though. Star? No star. Yeah, no star. Now I'm putting rope lights above my mirror. Changing out the soap. Okay, so far so good. Next I'm working on my shower and dealing with this closet. Scene with part two. Part two, I'm gonna restock and decorate the shower. First I'm taking everything out. Also, I broke a nail, so don't mind that. I tried anyway. So clean. Finally, now I'm gonna put these clear shelves up. You guys, it looks so good. Let's put my stuff back. Top shelf's gonna hold shampoo and conditioner, hair mask, hair clip for the hair mask, or shampoo and conditioner. Next shelf's gonna hold body conditioner, body scrub. These shower gels are my favorite. They smell so good. Look at these mini tree hub body scrubs. They're so cute and they smell amazing. Lastly, candy cane shave oil. Last shelf's gonna hold body wash and body conditioner. Also, I bought this thinking it was candy cane body wash, but it wasn't. It's conditioner. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that right here. I'm also gonna put a Christmas tree here. And this, I don't know, but it's festive. I put up these acrylic hooks to hold my loofah, my razor. Oh, nice, I'm running out of time. See you in part three. Part three, I wish I could scream. I'm so excited. Finally gonna decorate and restock everything, starting with my DIY bath cart. For the first shelf, I'm filling two jars with lavender and eucalyptus foaming bath. Next shelf is gonna hold bath flowers and I'm putting them in these cute little jars. Also, I put sugar cubes in this jar and that's going in the middle. Last shelf is holding cow print face masks, Way bath bombs, and then this. I thought they were fake roses, but it's actually soap. <laughs> cloud-shaped bath mats, so I'm gonna make my own. I can do this. I just cut it in half. Now I have to make those two look like that. Poof, ta-da. Now I'm gonna wash them and see what happens. How does that work? I thought it was gonna fall apart in the washer, but it didn't. Oh, normal house, and then bam, portal. Last thing I have to do is restock my shower shelves, normal shelves, and my drawers. I'll see you in part four. And no, it won't take three days to stop. Part four, I'm gonna restock and decorate my whole bathroom, starting with the shower shelves. First shelf is holding hair products, so we have my shampoo, a hair mask, and scalp scrubber. I'm gonna use the hook to hang this fake eucalyptus plant. And this one for my razor. The shelf below that is gonna hold shaving products like the shaving oil, shave butter, and coconut melt, sugar scrubs. This one smells like real orange, like freshly peeled. I'm I'm in love. How do I only have two shelves done? This one is for shower creams, body oils, and body masks. Last one's for body washes. Yeah, day night, and whenever I feel like I need more collagen. I don't know. I feel like I'm in a dream. Also, I linked the shelves on my Amazon storefront in my bio. So excited. Now I'm going to decorate the main shelf. Top one's going to hold body brushes. Skipping to the middle, this one shelf is the reason why I redid my entire bathroom. So yeah. I found these at the container store. I'm using them for bath salts. This one's lavender, lemon, eucalyptus, and mandarin. I may or may not need a part five, but every video has been good so far, right? I'm so close. Also, it's almost 4 a.m. I'll see you in part five. Part five, I'm going to hang eucalyptus onto my shower head with a hair tie. Why haven't I done this before? It looks so good. I've also never put a tray on my toilet before. It's 4 a.m. Ha ha. Why do I do this to myself? Um, at least I have a cute bathroom. I just filled this with lush bath bombs and I'm putting them on the shelf. Got this candle at home goods. It says Cupid, you're fired. I had to get it. The last thing going on the shelf is this book and it's random, but it's so cute. I almost forgot lotion. I'm putting that on top. I feel like I'm in my dream bathroom. Almost done. Last thing I need to do is restock my cabinets and drawers. So please enjoy this ASMR while I do that. Oh my gosh, I'm finally done. Now you know how to make a glow spa. Good night. Part two, welcome to my room. Doing Amazon first because I don't remember what I ordered. ASMR. Ice face roller. Hazel thinks it's a toy. I needed a car vacuum and this one looked cool. Here's your hint for my next video. I wasn't going to show this one, but here we are. My elbows are so dry, so when you put lotion on them, you put these on your elbows and it's supposed to help. Car hooks. Mini glass straws. This was supposed to be a lot bigger. I'll still use it. Next box. So excited about this. Not this because I love s'mores, but you extend it and then you turn this. Now I can make the perfect roasted marshmallow. <laughs> Cereal dispensers. More car stuff. Look how cool this is. It sticks to your fridge. Also comes with this clear notepad. My new favorite thing. Acrylic drawer organizers. That's it for Amazon. I'll link everything on my storefront under things I recently bought. Next is skins. I kind of went a little crazy. I'm excited for the skincare, but I'm sorry. Does this not look like the talking hat from Harry Potter? <laughs> I love these, so I stocked up and I got this bodysuit. I've never tried Set Active, so I got some things. Fenty and ColourPop. I have more Amazon stuff coming, but that's it for now. Yo, what up? My family coming in an hour. So I'm gonna try and make a mini snack bar. I have to hurry. First, I'm filling the bowl. This one's gonna have strawberry cream marshmallows. I have to tell you guys why my family's coming. It's really exciting. Hershey's kisses. These are so cute. I was nominated for Lifestyle Influencer of the Year. They're announcing the winners today. I don't think I'll win, but who knows? I just wanted to celebrate that I was even nominated. That in itself is crazy, so thank you guys so much. This one's gonna have mini eggs. I got mini tongues for these two, but this one broke, so I'll just use a scoop. Putting everything on my island. Putting all this stuff on the stand. 
popcorn in the middle. Strawberry soda, I don't know. So I did not end up winning, but I'm so grateful that I was even nominated. Like that is insane. I don't even, I don't even have words for it, but I just want to thank you guys for even putting me in that category, like being put amongst five other incredible people. That is insane. So thank you guys so much and I will see you in the next video. Yo, what up? I'm finally gonna unpack and organize my new kitchen. I have an island now, by the way. <laughs> First, I'm organizing all the cups. I think I'll put all the clear ones on one shelf. I don't know. Got my nails done, by the way. I think they're so cute. Little girls. These remind me of being in chemistry. Next shelf is gonna hold my water bottles. And these ones on the other side. Almost forgot about these clear ones. Lastly, all my mugs are going on top. This is my favorite mug. It's so cute, except this part. Why'd they ruin it? Okay, I'm finally done. I'm gonna put my cutting board back and my flower vase. Still have to figure out how to decorate this area, but at least this part's done. Anyways, next I'm organizing my Starbucks cups. I'm so excited. You guys have no idea. Redecorating my living room part six. I found a rug. Not that one, that one. And I found everything else to finish this today. It's a gray and white rug from Ikea. I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'll just have to show you. Staying Jerem? I don't know, but it's perfect. Now I'm gonna work on the two sides. I found these at TJ Maxx. I know they're for plants, but I'm gonna use them for my lamps. Yeah! I think it looks so much better higher up. Now I can decorate in front of it. I got this at Home Goods. I'm adding this plant because it makes me feel like I'm on vacation, and that's basically the theme of this whole living room. I'm debating whether I should paint this or buy a whole separate planter. We'll see. Now I'm adding this thing, and I ordered a small blanket to put on top of this to break the colors up. That's it for the right half. I did the same thing on the left side, and I'm adding this basket for blankets. I like to roll my blankets up before I put them in. Ah, so cute. They look like gray cinnamon rolls. I can finally start decorating the TV stand. I'm leaving this over here. Everything is Love Island inspired. I have a problem. Somebody watch it with me. I also got some fairy lights to put into each of these. I'm doing a separate reveal video this time because last time I didn't have enough time to show you my room, but at least you'll be able to see what it looks like during the day and nighttime. I will see you tomorrow. Yo, what up? Decorating my room part three. I need nightstands, so I'm gonna try and make them. Hopefully I don't make a giant mess. Throwing that hope out the window. This is gonna be so messy. Now I'm putting on primer. Not sure if you have to, but just in case. Next, I'm putting drywall tape all over. Time for the messy part. I'm gonna mix everything in this bucket. I'm gonna start with two parts plaster. And a cup of water. Well, I already messed up. It's very watery. Okay, I figured it out. I'm pouring the whole box in here. Then I'm adding water and mixing till it looks like frosting. Yeah, I did it. Okay, first layer. I'm done. I'm never doing that again. I cleaned up the mess because it was that bad. Anyways, I primed it with this. Now I'm gonna put them in my room. Oh my gosh, I love them so much. I think they're so cute. Still have a lot to do, but I'm gonna take a break and start working on my kitchen. L O L. Yeah, it needs. Hi guys. So I just got a package from the American Influencer Awards, and kind of freaking out. This is so crazy. I was nominated for Lifestyle Influencer of the Year for 2022. I just wanted to come on here and thank you guys so much. I wouldn't be able to do any of this without you. And <laughs> just freaking out. I don't even know how to like make words right now. Voting ends August 31st. You can vote every single day and I would truly appreciate your vote. I keep doing this just cause I'm just so excited. I just want to jump around. <laughs> ah, thank you so much. I love you. Um, Link will be in my bio. I'll be in the lifestyle category. Just scroll all the way down and don't forget to vote for all your favorite creators too. Okay, love you. Bye. Resetting my entire house part five. Now I'm going to restock the mini fridge. First I'm filling the mini bottles. Pomegranate cherry juice. This stuff is so good. Next water. These ones are glass and they're a little bit taller. So I'm just gonna put it in. For fruit, I'm doing mango, blackberries, raspberries, lastly strawberries. I love fruit. I'm putting these on the bottom shelf. It looks so good. Next, Lunchables, Capri Sun, Go-Gurt, yeah. Baby Bell Cheese, Coffee. I'm filling the smaller ones with jelly beans, oh, and chocolate eggs. I didn't know what else to put in here, but this looks good. Next step, I'm organizing my cup collection because it's so good. I'm going to reset my whole house. Well, I'm going to try. I'm not leaving this up till March this time. Oops, got a Christmas tree bucket. Yay! It's kind of sad. It's all empty and cold now. Okay, now I'm gonna vacuum. I'm just gonna throw things. Got these really cute cloud pillows for my couch. I love them. And that's my living room. I didn't think it was gonna take me this long. I still have. I could just forget this is all here. Next, I'm decluttering and deep cleaning my room. I will see you in part 5,000. One of my 3 a.m. purchases. Well, a few. A honey pot plush. Now I have <laughs> honey boba bear. This. I'm just kidding. Um, this stuff though, like, oh. I'm spraying sour spray on my face. And then this. Really. Wait, I should have made a three minute video. Water bottle drying rack. And it holds strong. Okay, so like you have a cutie, right? And then you just go like this with the little ring thing and it's just easier to open. I get really motivated at 3 a.m. So I bought a shelf. Basically, when I buy something for a video or a company sends me product for a video, instead of throwing it around my room on the floor or just random places, I will organize it on here. <laughs> the mess I make after one TikTok is... It's so bad. Let's just clean this. Scotch Bright sent me their advanced scrub dots, non scratch scrubbers, and I'm gonna see if they really work. I'm gonna put everything in the sink first. I'm just gonna. 
I usually hold my scrubbers awkward like this, but it's shaped like a hexagon, so it makes it way easier to hold. And it rinses clean without trapping the mess inside the sponge. So that was easy. It's nice I don't have to worry about my countertops because they're non-scratch. And look, it stands on its side. Now I'm finishing up the dishes. Okay, it's all clean and ready for the next mess. If you want to try them, they're available at Walmart. And if you purchase in store at Walmart through October 23rd, you'll earn points too. Just pretend I did. Spring cleaning part four. Oh, part four, the pantry. Also part four. Gotta make space for my pre-workout, so I'm clearing out this bottom shelf. I got motivated and I cleaned the entire cabinet, so time to put the stuff in. All right, let's move on. Now time to fill the cereal containers. sure to label them with the date they expire on time to put them in the pantry now i'm just finishing up the labels for the flour sugar and cookies wait did i spell flour right okay just making sure <laughs> last container is for our coffee beans Oof. and this is the last thing i needed to do final reveal wow this looks so amazing i'm so proud of myself thank you for joining me on the series i have so much more to do <laughs> Make sure to follow me to see what's next. I'm gonna try and make an aesthetic hot chocolate bar again. First, I'm filling the sprinkles. This one's gonna be blue with white snowflakes, peppermint, marshmallow, Christmas, I don't know, s'mores, random blue one I'm gonna make. I'm gonna put them here. I'm so excited. Now I'm gonna fill the small containers. First one's gonna have polar bear marshmallows, gingerbread men, peppermint hot chocolate toppers, and these really cute snowman ones. These are gonna go on top. Now I'm gonna fill the bigger ones. Look what I found. I'm so excited to try these. Hot chocolate powder. Did not go as planned. Pretzels. Lastly, hot chocolate stirs. Now I'm just labeling everything. And that's it, it's so cute. Next I'm setting up my glow spot, but it's gonna be Christmas themed. Part three of the mystery box Daniela sent. She took the time to wrap and put stickers on this. It's so cute. A freaking glitter beach ball. Hold up. Oh, the glitter moves, oh my God. Next is this. We have some nail files, this cute scrunchie. This is a scrunchie with tails, that's so cute. And some hair ties, I actually really needed these. I'm gonna go for this one. Oh cute, it has the Candy Boulevard sticker on it. Thank you for taking the time to wrap these, it's so cute. Oh my gosh, no way. Oh, this is way more than I expected. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, I'm just cutting onions in the background. A magic towel, my sister would love this. A pineapple keychain. What is this? Oh, okay, it's like a roll-on aroma thingy. That smells amazing. Some Listerine pocket packs. A cranberry hand sanitizer. And a transparent case that has Mickey Mouse on it. Some sour belts. <gasps> More sour belts from Candy Boulevard, yay! I think I'll be able to finish this in part four. I'll see you soon. I'm still trying to become that girl, so I bought a gym bag. Let's fill it. I don't even go to the gym. I work out at home. That's my drawer. But oh, first a water bottle. It's my favorite color right now. A squat band. This works really well. Waist trimmer. This jump rope. Found this really cute case. In here, I'm keeping smaller things like tampons, chapstick, hair ties. It's gonna go in the front pocket. Booty bands. Sweat towel. You know. Headband that you tie. Deodorant. Hairbrush. I found another pocket, by the way. There's a side pocket, and I'm putting hand sanitizer in here. Resistance band. Ankle weights, maybe. I don't know. And AirPods. And a tripod. And a protein bar. Dry shampoo. A change of clothes. I'm just kidding well actually i don't know okay i think that's spring cleaning part four the pantry part three i got the buckets and i filled them let's put them in oh yeah i also picked up this really cute woven basket i'm going to be putting waters in it okay room temperature water or ice cold water is the question so i bought these chalk labels and a chalk marker and we're going to start labeling the gray boxes a a <laughs> Done. My favorite is saucin for all the sauces. This is the last one. <gasps> wow! I have a lot more to label, but I want to fill the containers first. I got these cute jars at Walmart for five bucks, and I'm going to be filling it with flour and sugar. Oh gosh! Here we go. They are so cute. I also got one for cookies. We're going to be doing chips away for this one. Now I need to find a place for my pre-workout. I'm thinking about emptying that bottom shelf there and then put all the cereal into the containers and label them and then I will be done. I will see you surprisingly really soon. And here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Actually, I woke up at three to get to my Starbucks at 5 a.m. I went a little crazy, but it's for the cup collection, so it's fine. The first one I got was this rainbow dome lid. Look at the straw. That's so cute. People are saying this was the pride cup. It's so pretty. Look at the top of this water bottle. They match. And then I got this one. Ah, it's like emerald, right? This is emerald. This one is so... This the only one on the shelf and i was first in line you should have seen me i was like Whoa. this reminds me of someone named flo that's what we call hazel when she smiles 
See, doesn't she look like a flow? This one is my favorite one. Same one, but different color. I got a stainless steel one, I don't know. I think I did a pretty good job at finding everything. Now it's time to put it away. These were too tall, so I had to take the straws out. I need to find a better way to display these because I want to see them all. But for now, I'm obsessed. Yo, what up? I got a package in the mail today. It's from Daniela. We did a swap. I have no idea what's inside here. All I know is that the theme is summer. Look how massive this box is. And it's really heavy. I'm so excited. Okay, let's get this out. Oh, that's so cute. Girl, where do we even start? We'll start with this. <gasps> it's a hibiscus beach towel. Oh my god. This is my favorite flower and my favorite drink at Starbucks. The hibiscus drink. Thank you. Okay, let's open this next. This is so cute. Okay, so we have a ball. Hazel's probably going to steal that from me. A tie-dye kit. Reusable ice cubes. Oh, a Grogu pop socket. What is this? A watermelon fan. That's cute. I'm going to take out some of this. A squeezable bottle kit. Bubbles. Oh, it says bubbles. Okay, we have some stickers. Hello Kitty zip top bags. These are little dessert baggies. This is so perfect. I'm making Oreo balls for a family gathering and this is gonna work perfect. Daniela, you went insane. This box is still so heavy. I'm gonna have to do a part two, but give me like 20-30 minutes while I film. Organizing my makeup and skincare, I kind of just put everything on the floor so I can start fresh. I have an idea of what's going in each drawer, but I don't know how I'm gonna organize it, so let's see what I come up with. This drawer is going to be my lip and lash drawer. I've been waiting so long to unbox these and put these on display. I got these frosted trays from Target, and I'm using them to organize my lip glosses. You know those lashes that you can wash and reuse a couple of times? I never know what to do with them after the first use. At Home Goods, I found this pack of three trays that come with the lid, and I'm just gonna store them in here. This is what the front of the drawer looks like. I still can't believe that Too Faced sent me my first makeup PR box. <laughs> storing all of my makeup palettes in this drawer and i'm going to organize them by using these palette organizer things i'm putting the most aesthetically pleasing palettes in the front and instead of having them stand up like this i'm using this container to hold them at a slanted angle and as you can see i have an addiction to boxy charm well this is what the front looks like but how am i already out of time i just talk too much let's be real i'll probably end up finishing this around two or three o'clock in the morning so i'll see you in part two part three finally the pantry i'm gonna be here all night first i'm taking everything out and putting it on the counter thanks for watching bye just kidding i don't want to do this Okay, kind of. Now I'm gonna try and find all the expired stuff. I just found a mini pie and donut maker. Also, the sun's up now. I gotta have these. Now I'm gonna check the can. There's so many crumbs. This expired in 2018. Ew. Oh my gosh, you guys, I finally did it. I'm gonna go pack my glow spot. Forgot I had this. It's a cherry toilet cleaner. Anyways. This is so sad. Well, I'm not crying. You are. See you in part four at the new place. Yoda. I'm still trying to become that girl, but I can't be that girl without a cute entryway. <laughs> Okay, one of my lights just fell on me. Anyways, first I'm gonna hang up the mirror. Okay, this is my favorite 3 a.m. purchase I've ever made. I have to clean it though, it's very dirty. Got this acrylic table from Home Goods. That's gonna go in the middle. Now I'm gonna decorate. I found these books on Amazon. I thought they were so cute. I'm gonna use the orange and yellow. Look how cute this chunky mug is. I'm gonna put it on top of the books. And a squiggle candle right behind it. Not sure what to do with the other side, so I'm going with this plant. A bubble candle that smells so bad, but it's really cute, so it's fine. Lastly, a tray. Clear or checkered though. Yep, that's pretty much it. I love it so much. Next, I'm finishing part two of my Starbucks cup. I think it looks better without the rug. Anyways, okay. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try to be that girl at Disneyland. I just had to get a bubble maker because, yeah. Next, cute drinks and snacks. This is the confetti cake shake. It's so fruit. This is a lollipop and a piece of cake. It's really good. A cookie. Cotton candy. And the blue milk. Also, it has glitter in it. It's kind of cute. Space soda. Carne asada fries. Not cute, but really good. Popcorn. Next shopping, I need to find the Starbucks cup. Oh my god. Ice chai is so good. This is cute. Need this. And this. I can't decide. I think I'm gonna go with Snow White. Yeah. Two of these. Popcorn. These are all gifts, by the way. I forgot to mention. I'm trying to convince myself not to get these. Mint julep. A vignette. I wrote a bunch of rides, but I forgot to film it. I'm getting my nails done. Couldn't decide between these two, so I asked you guys on Instagram, and this one was. They're so cute! I'm just gonna hope for the best. I picked out all the colors except yellow and green, and I was called complicated. I'm so confused. I'm done. She kept burning me with the drill, and every time it would be like, oop, or ow, she would look at me and laugh. I can't make this stuff up. They cut me with the drill. Trigger warning. I'm going to show you that. Look at that. Like, ow. It was bleeding earlier. Maybe she was nervous. There was a girl next to me watching her laugh at me. Girl. Anyways, here's what we have so far. They had a mustard yellow and a lime green. I tried to see if they can mix white in it to make it look more pastel. And it just looked like caca. So I told her I would do these on my own. I'm going to mix these two colors with white. Well, wish me luck. Okay. Okay. Never mind. It was way too clumpy. No cute nails for Kelly, I guess. At this point, I'll go somewhere else and I'll post a picture of them when they're done on my Instagram. First thing in the morning because I'm not staying like this. Yo, what up? White Fox sent me $1,500 worth of clothes. Um, I'm gonna cry. Best part is I got to choose every single piece. So I'm gonna show you my favorite outfits. I'm so excited. First, this really cute sweat set in the color gray. It's so cute. And it's really soft. 
I got another color. I can't decide which one I like more. Like this green is everything. Okay, keep these two in mind for just a second. I'm going to Florida, so which one of these should be my airport thing? Before you decide, look at the back of this one. See what I'm saying? What do I do? I also got this really pretty bodysuit, and it's all the way open in the back. <laughs> Last thing I want to show you are these bike shorts and shirt. I just want summer to be here. It's like 12 degrees outside, so I'm gonna have to wait on these. But for the summertime, you will see me in this. There's still so much more. They also gave me a really cute code. It's Honey TikTok. I'm doing a try-on haul of everything I got on my YouTube channel. As a thank you to White Fox for sending me these. I'm so excited to wear everything I could grab. Yo, what up? I was gonna clean my car, but I'm not feeling good today. It's that time of the month and all I wanna do is lie down and go to sleep. And wait. I'm gonna show you what I got for it so far. Then I'll restock and organize it tomorrow. First a visor makeup mirror. My car lighting is yellow, so I like that you can change the color and there's two mirrors. LEDs for the inside of my car. I'm most excited for this. Swinging Craig for my visor. This bag to organize stuff. For some reason, I like eating in my car, so I got a vacuum to pick up the crumbs. Any trash can, so I stopped throwing stuff on the floor. I got the car slot. Hopefully it actually works. I like to keep affirmation cards in random places, so I got these for my car. These are some of them. I think they're so cute. Registration holder. Bunch of hand sanitizer. This cup, nothing to do with anything. I just thought it was cute. Cleaning stuff. This is one of my favorite brands. And this acrylic box. That's all I have so far. Next, I'm actually gonna restock and organize my car. See you in that video. Good night, guys. Yo, what up? I'm gonna make a Disney gift basket and give it to someone random. I'm gonna put everything in a backpack, but I can't decide this one or that. Now I'm trying to find the donut ears. It took me an hour, but I found them. Now let's go to Starbucks. Okay, the line's way too long. I'm gonna get this hat. So cute. Lollipop. Beach towel. Why not? Now I'm gonna pick out some pins. You know, start someone's collection. Little Mermaid. Also, there's a duck. Ricky. Star Wars. Mystery pin set. Favorite one of the castle. Look how cute. Mermaid hand sanitizers. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. I had to get one for me too. Also, I love how I'm just on this, this pen. Got this lanyard. Now I'm gonna fill the backpack. This view right here is so aesthetic. Oh my now I need to find someone to go give this to. Hi! Um, so I'm filming a TikTok where I just made this gift basket and I'm giving it to someone random. So I'm just gonna give this to you. That worked out perfect. She was actually a fan, so that was great. I literally love you if you're watching this. Okay. Take it all in. I just woke up and I couldn't wait to make this video. I went to Sephora and I got. Oh, I'll be trying it for the first time. Hopefully it can help my hair. I've been straightening my hair every day since seventh grade. So yeah. Also, Faith Force sent me this whole goodie box. I'm gonna be trying their one minute mask. Got the shampoo, conditioner. My ends feel so soft. Now the mask. I don't use that much. It smells like vacation. Ah! It feels kind of dry, not gonna lie. I'm just gonna trust the process. So I'm gonna use this smooth for sure blowout cream. It's supposed to be a heat protectant as well, so I'm gonna let it finish air drying and then I'm gonna style it. Okay, my hair is dry and it's so soft, I was worried for a second. To straighten my hair, I use the Silk Elements heat spray and then the Wet to Straight straightener from Walmart. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. I'm gonna use Texture Spray and Shine Spray by Air. <gasps> okay, wow. I'm gonna try to paint these baby pumpkins. I have all the colors for each design I'm gonna do, so yeah, wish me luck. This one's gonna be cute, just wait. I don't have a blow dry. Okay, first one done. That one took forever to dry, so I'm gonna do the first layer on all of them first. This one's green, yellow, white, this one's tan, light purple, and another green. Couldn't help it. I finished the culprit one, now I'm working on this one. It has stars on it. Now I'm doing this abstract smiley face one. I don't know if it's gonna look good, but it's my favorite one. <laughs> now I'm gonna work on this one. Oh yeah, I did that. Don't know how I feel about it, but think about it. I am the only one in the universe at this exact angle at this is exact moment i'm just redoing this one I regret doing that oh my gosh don't mind that one but the rest of those like i would separate them and put them all around my house but they just belong together you know why i haven't posted in two days it's because of these so bye yo what up i just woke up broke off all my nails last night so i'm getting them done tomorrow can't decide what i want so i'm gonna let the top comment choose for me i forgot i bought these so let's open them because i'm freaking bored i'm looking for lunchables and capri sun if they have it. okay that's a shopping cart what is this not a lunchable. Nope. No, but the baby bell is really cute. I refuse to do a part two. Speed round. No. Nope. 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 Kool-Aid. That's close enough. Come on, lunchable. How many times am I gonna get this one? Nope. No. This is my last one. Come on, I just want a little lunchable. Nope. Things are not looking <laughs> Okay, well, all that for nothing. Well, Kool-Aid. My sister is really crafty, so I'm gonna give them to her and see what she makes. I'm gonna try to become that girl. Starting with my fridge, it's giving... <sighs> expiration date. Um, I'm gonna take everything out so I can deep clean Put most of it in the freezer because it's probably gonna take me a few hours. I'm pretty sure I can take the shelves out. really clean now it's time to fill it back up i got an egg container i feel so fancy this is so extra okay in this container i'm doing strawberries and raspberries this one will have blackberries and blueberries this is so pretty am i on pinterest i can eat a whole bag of cherries in one day so it's getting its own container so i can use it as a plate and grapes. these are going on the middle shelf i cut up some watermelon so i'm putting it in this container same thing with pineapple this one's gonna have cut up vegetables to snack on crisper container thing i don't really know what it does but i'm putting my greens in it oh my gosh i didn't realize it was gonna take this much work to become that girl this is just the fridge like i wasn't ready look how aesthetically pleasing this is well <laughs> whose fridge is this not mine it's that girl's so beautiful now i'm gonna put the juices in separate i'm just kidding <laughs> 
I'm not doing that. Putting the cheese and butter here. Coffee and cream are going on this shelf. This stuff is so good, by the way. It tastes like a banana milkshake. Sauces, Capri Suns will go here because I'm addicted. Almost done. After six hours, this is what it looks like. And I love it so much. This is my favorite part. There's so much space. It looks like I need to go grocery shopping, but I don't. Next step, redecorating my bed. Grab a bowl. I broke all of mine and I broke my nails, but this will work. Add in two cups of heavy whipping cream. Whisk it and it should look like this when you're done. Now add in one cup of condensed milk. Whee. And a fourth of a cup of sour Kool-Aid. Mix it. Zang! It's so pretty. Put it in a squeeze bottle or a Ziploc bag. Grab a pan and some parchment paper and start making little dots. It's gonna be tedious, but that's not a dot. Okay, one second. Ow, 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 ow. Put it in your freezer for a few hours. I'm putting the rest of it in this ice cream container I got at Target. And now we wait. Okay, it's been a few hours. And they're done. Well, I feel like I should have made more. Now you know how I attempted to make dots, which are now called dipping dots. Okay, here we go. Mm -mm. Part two, let's take them out of the freezer. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. She's gonna love them. I'm gonna store them in a mason jar. These are the cutest dog treats I've ever seen. Just set everything up. Let's see if she likes her treats. Ready? Okay. <laughs> you like it. She's very gentle when she eats, so she's not gonna take a big bite out of it. Let's see if she likes the watermelon one. Yep. <laughs> she's so cute. Girl, high five. <laughs> Time to open presents. It's a look go through it toy oh my gosh she's so happy right now get it out baby oh my gosh i gotta open these for you what else did you get a mini pool here you go baby happy birthday I'm doing it i'm deep cleaning the laundry room viewer discretion advice hey yeah oh there we go it's basically it's pretty much i obviously don't take care of it first i gotta get everything out of the laundry room i'm gonna set everything on the table before i do that i'm taking all the clothes out and putting them away this is a cool angle I feel like I'm on the show. So, uh, now that all of that is out, I'm starting to take things off the shelves. It's so dusty and dirty. Okay, so now I'm on my dryer and we're gonna use this multi surface cleaner and I'm just gonna wipe everything down because we just got a letter. We just got a letter. I'm gonna clean the outsides of the washer and dryer. Well, let's see if I can get this. <laughs> Somebody come get her. Wow, this is what it looks like so far. Here's everything I'm gonna use to decorate with. There's still a lot of work to do. I gotta fill the boxes and the jars with the detergent. So I will see you in part two. I'm waiting for the paint to dry and I'm so bored. So I'm gonna read some of these cards. Going all out, I'm using one of these thingies. Okay, there's my foot. What do we have? Okay. When your class returns from gym and they smell like onions, bro, there's always that one kid that's smelling like B.O. Oh. oh, this is like my worst nightmare. When you can't figure out who keeps carving. <laughs> carving corn. <laughs> when a kid flicks a booger at you and you find it in your hair four hours later. Okay, one more. This is fine. When you accidentally stick your hand in the gum under the desk. This is fine. It is not fine. This has happened to me so many times as a student. The room reveal will be uploaded tomorrow. I can't wait. Yo, what up? Got a package in the mail from Courtney. It's only open because I had to rip off her address. This is a swap and I have no idea what's in here. The only thing I do know is that our theme was pink. So whatever's in here is pink. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's a note. This is so cute. I'm just thinking about the note I gave you. It's not as cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know where to start. I'm probably going to say cute a lot. Oh, <gasps> this is so soft. Yeah, it's my favorite lip oil. A surprise ball. Let me open it real quick. You're supposed to unwind it and I got this little fortune. Yeah. <sighs> Oh my god, this is actually really fun. So far I've gotten a tattoo and this pocket crystal ball. Nice. Next we have some Oreos. <gasps> yes! Thank goodness, I've been eating some of these. Truffles, I've never had this flavor. Ooh, there's something inside. This is so cute, they're erasers. I'm taking some of this out. Crayon lip smackers. This mask is so cute. This is everything so far. The box is still really heavy. I'm running out of time, so part two will be up in like five minutes. Grab a bowl, pour some chocolate into the bowl, melt the chocolate in your microwave and mix every 15 seconds. Your chocolate should look like this when you're done, and I got different colors from Amazon. Yay. Grab your chocolate and place it into the mold. You're going to spread it around the walls. Also, you can use whatever molds. I'm using pumpkins, acorns, and cubes. Once the molds are filled, stick them in your fridge for 15 to 20 minutes. In the meantime, grab a baking pan and fill it with liners. They're done! Once you've taken them out of the molds, put them in your pan. That is just so cute. 
Fill in the bottom half with hot chocolate powder and top them off with marshmallows. Grab the other half and place it on a warm pan to melt the edges. Once the edges are melted, place them on top just like that. Put them back into the fridge for about five more minutes. Take them out and that's it. Now you know how to make hot chocolate bombs. There's the acorn, the red pumpkin. Okay, let's just try them. Here's my warm cup of milk. I've decided we're going with blue acorn. Hope this opens in time. Here we go. Oh, oh, it's bubbling. <gasps> that is so cool. Yay. And it's blue. Yo, what up? I found it. I found it. I didn't just find one, though. I found four. <laughs> this is what it looks like without the filter. Like, wow. I'm obsessed. And the straw. Let me show you the straw. Wow. It's just so cute. Anyway. Okay. They're not all mine. These two are for family members. That one is mine. And this one is for you. These are not easy at all to find right now, unless you're paying like double or triple the price. So I hope this finds someone that was looking for it. And maybe it'll give you a chance to win one. This is an Instagram giveaway because it's way easier to track and select a winner. All you have to do is follow me on Instagram and on the Instagram post about this giveaway, just comment whatever you want and tag one person that loves Starbucks. More details about this giveaway will be on my Instagram post, so have fun you guys and good luck! Yo, what up? I used to work at Bed Bath & Beyond and the one thing I loved doing was folding towels, so I'm gonna show you how I fold my towels. At Bed Bath & Beyond, they have these tables with measurements on them. Since I don't have that, I'm just gonna use my hand. First, I fold the bottom up about the size of my hand. <laughs> towards you and you fold it to the top and then you do the same thing one more time like that I'll turn it towards the right and fold it in half like that and then fold it in half one more time and that's it I normally do this on a table but it's full of stuff right now so I'm gonna have to wash these right after but I just love the way they look when they're folded like this they're super fluffy I love it. this is my linen closet and see I like it I'm gonna try to become that girl, but I need an aesthetic night routine, so let's plan one out. First, hydrate. I don't have any more lemons. I'm gonna make a cute snack to post to my Instagram. First, add yogurt and flatten it out. Clean the edges. Now just add some fruit and make it look cute. And granola, I like this one. I'm getting ready for my that girl shower, so I'm laying my PJs out on my bed. This stuff, so good. I always start with my hair. I use Olaplex once a week. And Moroccan oil every day. This is my favorite hair mask right now. Now I'm gonna grab a clean washcloth. Body wash. It's hard to film and shower at the same time. I'm literally not even doing it. I'm gonna do it after. Yep. Now I'm gonna exfoliate. This stuff is so good. I feel like it works better when you use the glove. Time to shave. This is the best for getting dead skin off your feet. Body conditioner. Now I'm actually going to shower. I'll be right back. Lotion. More lotion. Double cleanse. If it's not image skincare, I'll still like it, but not as much. The scrub. It's giving a Mike Wazowski, but we like that. Man. Oh my goodness, this is a lot of work. I forgot toner. We'll try again next time. Serum. So steady. Finally, eye cream and moisturizer. Glossy. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. Always tap your toothbrush for good luck. My hair is basically dry. I'm going to put it up with this towel scrunchie. Now I'm just getting more water. Okay, so <laughs> you didn't make it. She does this every night. Here's your ice cube. I don't have a humidifier, but I do have a book. And I'm going to watch Love Island. I'm probably not going to sleep until 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, but I did it. Anyways, next step, an aesthetic morning routine. I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl with dirty makeup brushes, so let's clean and organize them. I got some new makeup brush holders, and they just make sense. They have a lid. Yay, no more dust. Okay, let's go wash my nasty makeup brushes. I'm going to use this because I can't find my baby shampoo, and I'm pouring it into this bowl. It's been two hours. I'm halfway done, and I'm on the floor. <laughs> Yay, I'm done. I'm gonna let those dry. I'm gonna use my old beads because the new ones look kind of yellow. Everything is pretty much dry and I organized it by color. I'm doing smaller brushes on that side and bigger ones over here. I'm hoping I don't need a third one. Oh my, I've never, why? <laughs> these are so nice. Let me close the lid. Like, whose makeup brushes are these? They're that girl's. I have to try this. Grab some Oreos. You'll need about 27. Put them in a Ziploc bag and crush them. a lot the last few days. Set that aside, grab a pot, pour in one bag of white chocolate chips, and a can of sweetened condensed milk. Put that on the stove on medium heat. Constantly stir it until it's melted. Take it off the heat and add in your Oreos. Mix it all together and then pour it into a baking dish and flatten it out. Um, oh my god, I forgot the parchment paper. If you want, you can add extra Oreo pieces to the top. Leave it in your fridge for a few hours and I'll see you in I'm just kidding. There's not going to be a part two. Yes, it's been a few hours. Now I got to cut it into squares. Now you know how to make Oreo fudge. Let's try it. <laughs> How do you guys do that? Okay, here we go. Wow! It's really good and it's really chewy. I didn't. I thought it was gonna be hard as rock. Yo, it up. My nails are fire. Literally fire. Look at the flame. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Time for our daily hug. Bring it in. You're so warm. 
Okay, we're gonna be decorating my very first Christmas tree. I've always decorated family Christmas trees, never one of my own, so I wanted to include you guys in it because it's special. Let's do this. This is where I'm gonna put it, so I'm gonna move all this stuff to a different area. <laughs> Can I help you? <laughs> now I gotta mop it. So pretty, the first layer is down. I'm opening up the branches before each layer. Listen up, y'all, because this is it. The beat that I'm playing. Wait, oh my god! Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, oh. oh my god. Either I'm short or this tree is tall. Anyway, decorating the tree in part two. I'll see you in a sec. I'm walking on sunshine. Part five of the mystery box Daniela sent me. I wanted to do a close up of all the candy she sent me. Like, look at these cocktail gummies and a cocktail lollipop. Some Lucas powder candy. I used to get these from the ice cream truck when I was little. Kool Aid, Warheads, soda candy. Oh my gosh. These are so good. Next is this. It's wrapped so cute. It's a cocktail shaker set with the little umbrellas and the freaking cactuses. Some fruit discs, Kool Aid gummies, the more sour belts, and this Christmas tree racer. It's so cute. Oh, it's for your pencil. I knew it. I knew you were going to go for the ball. <laughs> Excuse me, she be it <laughs> No, you can't have that. That one's not for you. Girl, thank you so much for everything. And again, show her some love at Candy Boulevard because oh she got some good candy. Oh my gosh, I just can't stop looking at everything. This is just so sweet. Part two, resetting my room. I'm actually proud of myself. It's been worse. I'm gonna start with the obvious issue. Well, at least I can see my floor now. I'm gonna clear off the nightstands now. my favorite part. Ew. Now I'm gonna clear off my bed and put some new sheets on. Almost done. Now I'm putting everything back. Um, I forgot about the floor. This is so bad. It's so clean. Next step, decluttering and redecorating my dump site. I mean my bed. You know how a while back I reorganized my entire bathroom? My skin? feels so dry. I clearly don't have the right product, so I need to try something else. I'm gonna try Olay's body wash and rinse off body conditioner. Growing up, all my mom ever used was Olay. She still uses it, and she is so soft. Goodbye, dry skin. I'm so excited. This stuff smells amazing. Yes, I still need. It's time for the body conditioner. So far, so good. I'm gonna see how I feel tomorrow. This is only one week later. My skin feels so renewed and hydrated. Yo, yes, I think I found the one. Deep cleaning my nail cart because it's so bad right now. I'm just gonna start by taking everything off the cart. Wow, okay, the first shelf is done. Let's see how long this takes me. It's about one o'clock right now. The second shelf is done. Oh my gosh. Wow, now I'm just gonna wipe it down with the Lysol with hydrogen peroxide. This smells so good. Ew, there's so much dust. I took everything out of the bins. Now I'm gonna disinfect them with barbicide wipes. My setup is pretty much staying the same. I'm putting my most used products up top. Still keeping my nail tips and dual forms on this side. Um, wow! I forgot to mention I wiped all the little stuff with Barbicide too. I'm finally on the last shelf and it's 3 o'clock. Are you ready? Bam! Oh. My. God. Woo! <laughs> Life just hit me hard. So hard in the last few days. And in the middle of my series, I'll freaking rude, but can't sit around and cry in a corner forever. We have a room reveal to do. This is everything I'm gonna decorate with. I'm gonna start with the wall. My dream board is going behind my door, and she believes she could, so she did. It's perfect. The theme of my room is a vacation in Vegas. One, because I'm from there, and two, I miss going on vacations. And these palm trees are so perfect. I wanna get a custom made neon sign, but those are expensive, so these will do for now. Shelf number one, I have my TikTok skateboard and this cute thingy. I'm putting this cute plant on the second shelf. A basket of blush that I'm standing on this thingy. Just like that, and then a fairy light. This plant and a sign that says Babe Cave, so cute. And then on this side, I have another plant and some makeup brushes. And then I have this cool weather predictor, a candle and a crystal. More random stuff and more fairy lights. These are from Ikea, by the way. Last shelf, blah, blah, blah. Hi, Morphe, love you. <laughs> what is this doing open? You guys told me to get a rug, so I did. And this is my new chair. Look at that pattern. It just screams casino. Let's turn this on. Cue the music. Yo, what up? Oh, do I have a video for you? I'm so tired. I really think you're gonna like this one. I'm posting that video later today. But for this video, I don't know why I yell. <gasps> Look, my hair kind of looks like a bow or a big butt crack. 
I went to Sally's and I got this quick dip kit. The kit comes with nail tips, glue, and a fire. It also comes with the activator, brush on glue, and three dip powders. I'm going to be using white. So yeah, let's do my nails. I've never used a dipping powder before, so we'll see how it goes. I'm starting off by filing and buffing my nails. I'm not going to be using the nail tips that come with the kit because that's just too much work and too much filing to get the shape I want. I just bought some that cover your entire nail and their coffin shape, which is my favorite. I'm only doing one nail at a time in case I mess up. Ooh. Applying the glue. And I guess you just dip it in. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, yeah. This is the aftermath. Um, <laughs> I need more practice. I ripped my nails off because I filed them down too much. They looked like a birthday hat. Yo, what up? I got two packages in the mail today and we're gonna open them. They're from Boba Bow Slimes. Thank you so much. I love the packaging. I think we're gonna open up the lighter one first. I haven't seen what's inside yet, so I'm super excited. <gasps> no way! This is so cute! I love jelly beans! And we have 20 flavors. I'm opening this right now. The boba plushie! Get it, honey? Boba bear? Ah, I love it! The last thing in here was candy cane ice cream, and it comes with a little cone. Time to open the second box. This one is really heavy. Oh, it's a note! This is what the note says. Thank you so much, Christy. And there's a holiday restock on December 12th. Let's see what's in the box. Oh my god! We have brown sugar boba. I think this is for the DIY slime. Yup, I can't wait to play with that. This one is called the North Pole. I think this is crunchy slime. I've never had a crunchy slime. And this one is called baby Yoda boba. Eggnog cheesecake. And this one is Christmas cookie bars. I can't wait to smell this one. A slime cookie. I want to eat it, but I know I can't. This is a really cute bag. Let's see what's inside. I've never played with slime before, so come back for part two where I try slime for the first time. I got the cardboard game, so let's just see how this goes. I chose random dare cards and wrote them down. I'm scared. Oh no. Read your Google Slime. <laughs> no. My mom swears a UFO passed her house last night and I was trying to make sense of the picture she was showing me and I still can't. That was embarrassing. Take an ugly selfie and let the group meme it. Okay, here's the picture. I know, so cute. And yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Call blank and whisper the whole time you're on the phone. I'm still trying to become that girl. I can't be that girl without a houseplant, so I'm gonna try and plant one. First, I have to make the pot look cute, so I'm doing blue. It looks like a sky, right? Now I'm gonna try and add clouds. What is that? Fake clouds are better. So cute, the little clouds. Okay, so now I have to put in the potting mix. I don't know what I'm doing. I can't decide on what seeds I want to plant. Do I do the mystery flowers from the Billie Eilish concert? Or do I go pro and do veggies from Coachella? JK, not a mystery. It says wildflowers. I'm supposed to soak these overnight, so I'll be like an hour is good enough. I'm gonna put that on top. Wish this came with instructions. I'm gonna pour more potting soil on top. Just a little. Found this water bottle at Urban Outfitters, so now I'm just filling. There's a hole at the bottom, and I've just been standing. Figured that out. Uh, this is so cute. Okay, so now I'm watering it. Like, actually, Hazel's plant. She's still trying to become that dog. Anyways, now we wait. I don't think I did this right, but if you want an update, Instagram. Okay. My mom got me this box. It's kind of heavy, and I have no idea what's in it, so let's open it. I hope this isn't payback for the lip filler break. I'm so scared. If it's a bug, I will send mountains to your house. My mom has a phobia of mountains. Okay. <laughs> okay, like, Gift wrap and everything. So cute. <laughs> this is a cup I've been wanting and I missed out on. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I'm pretty sure I know what the rest of these are. She got me the Cosmo and Wanda cup I've been wanting. I can't. These are all the cups I missed out on last year. They're so perfect. A black and gold one. And the red stainless steel. I'm gonna go put them on my shelf right now. Thank you, mom. Part two of the mystery box Daniela sent. There's so much in here. Again, thank you, Daniela, for sending this. We have some ring pops. She has her own shop called Candy Boulevard, so if you see any candy in here you want, you can order from the link in her bio. This is so cute. It's a bath gift set. Oh my gosh. It's, oh my gosh. Pink lemonade candy straws. Thank you. Thank you. Just thank you. Flamingo lollipops. My heart. Cinnamon discs. Oh, perfect. A sticker that says you deserve it. I don't. I really don't. It's a binder zip case. I don't have a binder, but my sister does. My voice is starting to hurt. Ketchup and mustard on a chair on a freaking bench. Strawberry sour power straws. Yay, slaps. I see these on her page all the time and I've always wanted to try them. Are these bullies? Yes, they're bullies. Helados. Well, I tried. I'm trying to learn how to speak Spanish fluently. I know I'm Colombian and I don't speak Spanish. That's a story for another time. How? Please explain how there's still stuff in here and it's still so heavy. Okay, part three is coming soon. I'm still trying to become that girl and I can't be that girl without a body skin care routine, so let's plan one out. This is everything I'm gonna use. First step, dry brushing. I always brush towards the heart and this is the best for exfoliating. Next step, a body wash that has skincare ingredients in it like collagen and vitamin B3 complex. My favorite is Olay's Collagen Body Wash. It always makes my skin feeling super soft and hydrated and it smells good. Body conditioner. 
time for lotion, Ole now has a matching collagen body lotion that includes all the same skincare ingredients as the body wash. Since using it, my skin is visibly firmer and more radiant and it smells amazing. There's no greasy residue, which is amazing. I just feel fresh after using it. And that's it. It's a pretty simple routine since these products already have amazing skincare ingredients in them. Grab a bowl. You'll need one cup of cornmeal. I'm using bun. One cup of mozzarella. A little bit of salt. I'm just eyeing it. Set that aside and grab a pot. You can either do a cup of milk or a cup of water. My mom's probably watching this like, go! While that's warming up, let's open the griddle I just bought for this recipe. The milk is ready. Now pour it into your bowl. Um, don't pour in the milk all at once like I just did. While it's still warm, add in some butter. You don't even have to use a griddle. I just bought one because that's what my mom uses. And you just kind of go like this. Okay, mom, I got this. I have my stick of butter. Putting it in my hand like lotion. Take a little bit of this. I don't have gloves. I only have Ziploc bags. When it's in a ball like this, you kind of go like this. Transfer it to flatten it out. And then you hit the edges like that. <laughs> Technique. Keep checking on them and flip them once the bottom goes brown. Now you know how I attempted to make arepas for my Colombian family. It's almost 1 a.m. I'm going to see if my mom's awake to get a reaction. I'll see you in part two. Part two, let's stock the mini fridge. First, I'm filling the mini bottles. Pomegranate juice. I'm probably going to spill everything. Coconut water. Last four with just water. I'm going to put these on the bottom shelf. Now for the fruit, I'm doing raspberries and blackberries. Baby bell cheese. Lunchables and gogurt on the side. I found these snack containers at Target, and I'm just filling them with grapes. I bought four more, so I'm just filling them with chocolate. Can't forget Capri Sun, because I'm addicted. I've never had these, so hopefully they're good. Pickle Ricks, these are the best. I found this really cool looking soda. Strawberry applesauce. And watermelon hints. Okay, this is so worth it. It's so cute. Okay, I'm going in, and I'm asking for this. Possibly this. I can't decide. This is what we're working with. Wait, it gets better. What happened? Oh my gosh. <gasps> you guys! I just got back. Ready? Can we? Round of applause, please. These are so cute. These are easily the cutest nails I've ever had. Oh my gosh, I can't stop looking at them. They're so cute. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try. This is gonna go so bad. To make a snow globe glitter cup. Here's my glitter. Yikes. I also got some strawberries because grab some strawberries. You know, because of the recipes, grab some strawberries. Elmer's glue. Resin. Whatever it's called. Alcohol wipes. Distilled water. I forgot to buy a drill. Well, at least now, now you know how to make a glitter cup. I'm gonna make this video tomorrow, so excuse me while I go buy myself a new drill. Hello. Yo, what up? I'm dropping Hazel off to get surgery. She has a cyst on her head that they have to surgically remove. <laughs> raining. That'd be cute to get her some of her favorite things. I got her this cuddler bed. I just want her to be comfy when we take her home. Got her a new blankie. She loves this material. I don't know how to describe it, but it's super soft and plush. Most of all her toys have names, so this is Spot. And Spot is very cute. Got her a lick mat for yogurt and stuff. For obvious reasons, I had to buy these. This whole thing makes me so sad. And then she's gonna have a cone. A cone. Hi, baby. Hi. been about a month since Kelly has cleaned her room. Let's see what she's up to now. Eating freaking Cheetos and watching Love Island. Very productive. Oop, she's on the way to her room. Let's see if we can get her to notice it's dirty. On the count of three, yell, Kelly, clean your room. One, two, three. Kelly, clean your room. It doesn't look like she heard us. One, two, three. Kelly, clean your room. Will Kelly ever stop eating Cheetos and watching Love Island instead of cleaning her room? I guess we'll have to find out in the next episode. Hi guys, come with me to the ice castles. First, I'm going through this tunnel. Very narrow. Very claustrophobic. Building chairs. That's cool. the entrance. I'm scared like those are going to fall. This is everything during the day. This is at night. It's so pretty. Oh my god. That's cool. I must not fall through a window. Okay, okay. They're dripping water. Look at that wall. Can't really see me, but yeah. It's doing the thing. It's doing it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. This is really cool. glowy. Ah, must touch it. Oh, that's that was fun. Goodbye. Ice castles. Yo, what up? I'm getting my nails done because that thing destroyed them. Worth it though. It's beautiful. I'm gonna show them this. I put it together myself. Thank you. Girls don't cry and the sad face. So cute. Here's a little before action. The other side. My nail tech is gone till March. I'm going to a complete stranger. Same place though. Cross your fingers for me. I love them. Do you want to see them? Probably my favorite nails. It says girls don't cry. I might cry over these. Other side. These are the longest nails I've ever had, too. <laughs> I love them. We're finding a whole bunch of stuff. We're just random things on the road. So I'm going to show you some of the stuff we found. Look at this dragon. I think it's made out of, like, tire. Tires! That's cool. I found Craig. He's so cute. A giraffe. Oh, that's cool. Oh, no, he got poop on his shoe. 
Mm. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wow, so cool. This is so cool. I feel like I should add music to this. I'm gonna make a That Girl Car Essentials kit. Hairbrush, hair ties, first aid kit, anti frizz hair wipes, waxing strips, you never know. Lip balm, look how cute this is. Oh my. Lotion, bobby pins, sunscreen, toothbrush, floss, and toothpaste. Wrinkle releaser, hand sanitizer, lint roller, flashlight, tahin, light. Extra ball for hazel, and extra poop bags. Some cliff bars, a mini gorilla pod, charger, and an empty lipstick bottle with cash in it just for emergencies. A pen. And that's pretty much it. I've never made boba before. I guess all I can do is try my best. Even if I fail, it should taste good hopefully. First I'm gonna boil the water. Now I'm adding the boba. I think I'll do that's a good amount. Hopefully I don't need more. While that's boiling, I'm gonna make the drink. I don't have a shaker, so I'm gonna use this. I'm doing honeydew. This is gonna taste so good. That was creamer. Now I'm adding water. It also said to add hot water. I added ice. Now I'm gonna shake it. So far so good. Now I'm gonna put this in the drink. It looks good. Hopefully it tastes good. Okay, it's not bad. It could be better, but it tastes pretty good. Yo, what up? I bought Crocs for the first time, and I'm gonna try and decorate them. I'm gonna start with the white ones, but look how cute these are. I just organized all the gibbets. Now I'm putting them on this side to plan them out. First, I'm doing a lollipop and ice cream cone. Don't want cherries in this seashell. Found these bubbles, and I got a few because they're so cute. And I'm gonna use this mushroom. I also had Craig the flamingo. Literally, when I saw him, I screamed. That side's done. This one's gonna have an alien. Cute jellyfish. I'm gonna put him in. I'm so excited. Put the bubble right behind Craig, and I just think that's funny. <laughs> it's not even 3 a.m. <sighs> they're so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Excuse me. I what? Need lotion. These are so cute. Even Hazel thinks so, right? I found these at Walmart while I was shopping for a really cool recipe video I'm posting tonight. I'm almost positive Courtney has done a video on these. I'm gonna tag her because her content just makes my day. I'm just gonna read the ones that are kind of funny. Pop tarts, yeah. <clears throat> More on salt. Oh my gosh, look. This one is shaped like a cereal box. So I went, ah, oh, this one's cute. Rice Krispies. Bing mints. Okay, we're getting to the good stuff. This feels like a candy bar. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. There we go. Ah, dang it. Two milk drones and peas. And the last one feels like a bottle of sauce. Fish bone. If you turn your screen with me, that's everything. The only one I really liked was the Rice Krispies. Grab a bowl, add in one cup of flour, one teaspoon of sugar, one teaspoon of salt. Can you chew with your mouth closed, please? Set that aside, grab a grater and a block of cheddar. Yay! Use the side that looks like this. This is gonna look like a lot, but if you were to squish it all together, it would be able to fit in this one cup. Add in your one cup of cheddar and mix it. Now add in four tablespoons of butter and two tablespoons of water. Now mix that all together. It's easier if you use your clean hands. If it's still crumbly like this, add more water. When you're done, it should look like a ball of Play-Doh. Preheat your oven to 375. Line a pan with parchment paper. Roll out your dough. You're gonna want it pretty thin. Frequently push in your edges so you can avoid the cracks. Carefully transfer that over to your pan. With whatever you have, I was lucky to have this, cut out little squares. And then, I think you already know where this is going, poke little holes into them. Bake for about 10 to 15 minutes. Let them cool for about 5 to 10 minutes, and now you know how to make homemade Cheez-Its or cheese crackers. Let's try them. Okay, here we go. Besides the thickness, they literally taste like a cheese app! Part two, let's take it out of the mold. I'm so excited. I didn't realize that this is royal blue. I thought it was dark purple. What? I was reading the comments and I guess I didn't read the bag, but why does it still look purple to me? But okay, I'm just starting here. Oh my God. I'm going to be so sad if this breaks. Oh, the sprinkles didn't stick. Please, 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 please. <gasps> okay. It doesn't look like a galaxy yet. Let me try putting on the edible glitter spray. I hope this works. Let's see. <laughs> Well, I tried. It's not horrible. It's, you know, it's pretty bad. I can't find the little hammer, so I'm going to break it with this. <laughs> oh, so cool. Wow. Grab some strawberries. Wash them. Grab a small spoon. Take your spoon and cut into the strawberry, but not all the way, and pull out. Do this until you make your way around the whole thing. Don't mind my nails, by the way. Now that you have your first layer, start higher up and make a second layer. Once it looks like this, you can either leave the top like that or cut it in half. Now grab a skewer and poke it into the bottom of the strawberry. Put a whole bunch in a vase, and now you know how to make a strawberry rose bouquet. Every Mother's Day, I like to make my mom a DIY gift basket because she loves anything DIY. I'm doing a Mother's Day series so you can see how I make and what my mom's basket ends up looking like this year, so hopefully you can pull some in. I've gotten a lot of requests asking me to make a smoothie, so I'm going to show you how to make my favorite breakfast smoothie. I'm going to grab my magic bullet cup. This is the taller one. I just filled it a third of the way with ice. Two scoops of the super greens powder, which is about a half a tablespoon. One scoop of protein powder. Now I just stuff it with a whole bunch of greens. Add in half a banana and freeze the other half for next time. Fill the cup halfway with almond milk and the rest with cold water. And we're blending! Yeah, blending! And that is it. Wow. Let me know if you want to see more smoothie recipes. Also, I am filming part five.
as we speak. As you can see, there's paint all over my hands and fingers. I tried to wash it off, but it didn't come off. Spring cleaning part four, the pantry. Viewer discretion advised. Hiya! <laughs> so bad. Oh. I'm gonna start by taking everything out of the pantry and putting it on the counter. I knew it! I knew we had pepper! I kept going to the store to buy more! This side of the pantry is done and I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. There's still a whole other side! And I'm done! And it goes on a shelf. Now I'm gonna organize everything. I'm gonna have a pile for keeping and a pile for donating. Now that everything is kind of organized, I'm gonna take this method cleaner and spray the wired shelves down. And we're vacuuming! Now that the cleaning is done, I can start organizing and decorating. I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I got this can tracker. It can hold 54 cans, so I'm going to put this at the bottom shelf and we're going to start to fill it. This did not make sense to me at first, but now it does and it's really cool. So you put the can on and then you just push it and it aligns with the bottom. How did I not know this existed? That's all of my cans. Now I just have to put things in the buckets and label them. I'll see you in a couple of hours. I've been loving my case to five phone case and I may or may not have ordered a few more. Oops. But how can I not? They're six foot drop proof so I can drop it on purpose like this or an accident. Either way, my phone case is going to be protected. See? And I couldn't just get one. There are so many different styles to choose from. I couldn't resist. Like, look at this cow print one. Even celebrities like Kylie Jenner and Dua Lipa use them too. Now I'm going to show you the cases I got. First off, the packaging is beautiful. They even gave me sanitizing wipes to keep my phone clean. And yeah, times three, I got the cow print case. I still can't believe how cute these are. I also got these two. How cute would it be if you got the same case? If you decide to get one, be sure to use my code 15HoneyBoba for 15% off. Redecorating my beauty slash filming room. I feel like the series is never going to end. The shelves are here. Let's put them up. Yay, it's up. Oh man, I'm looking rough. I'm working on the fronts of the drawers first, and then I'm sorting my skincare by brand. This is what the front of the first drawer looks like. Now I'm organizing the second drawer. I'm matching the amount of containers on the makeup side to the skincare side. My floor is finally going to be clean. Let's start filling them. Also, I'm sorry about the audio going from low to crazy loud. I think it's happening to more people now, so hopefully TikTok is working on that. I forgot to film the process, but this is what the second drawer looks like. Doing five containers in this drawer. Also, drop your favorite makeup remover. I'm looking to move away from makeup wipes. I don't know why I keep using makeup wipes. It's so bad for your skin, but I heard micellar water is really good, so I'm going to try this. This drawer is like the body drawer. We have the pumps, the sprays, and the oils. Extra body scrubs, and after one leg, I realize that this is gradual tan. Can you imagine what my leg looks like right now? This one has serums and toners. This top one has cleansers and exfoliators. I don't know. I was just trying to fill the space. Three more drawers, decorating, cleaning, and I will be done. I will see you in a couple of hours. Part two. I'm at my mom's house. I hope she answers the door. Hello. Hi. Hi. You didn't Hi. answer me last night. <laughs> I first found to come too. He's very judgmental. Dum, dum, dum. So I'm scared. <laughs> yeah. Take one for the middle. Okay. Yeah. Do you approve? You did it. Really? Are they like moms? Yeah. Ah! Ah, I'm scared. Damn. <laughs> You're not even chewing it! I'm so much, what are you doing? <laughs> She's really out here making more. <laughs> <laughs> Part two, I gotta finish putting these on. That took forever. If they're on now, let's put them up. A lot of you said I should store these horizontally, which makes sense, so I'll just fix them later, and then I'll update you on my Instagram or something. This is the last one. I'm so excited! <gasps> wow. No, it's not perfect, but I'm just happy it came out decent. I'm starting to draw on it and I've already messed up. These markers are not the best, but this is my fifth time doing this, so it is what it is. I'm also making a calendar, which is the main reason why I wanted a chalkboard, and I think it looks really cute so far. Yay, I'm done! I went a little overboard with all the colors because I was really excited about them, but I love this thing so much, and I think I'm going to redo it. But for now, this looks great and I can't wait to fill it out. Yo, what up? I got a package in the mail today from Miles. This is a swap, so I have no idea what's inside here, so I'm excited. All I know is that the theme is self-care. Can I just say, this box smells like blueberries. It smells so good. Oh my gosh, I love this. Kind people are my kind of people. I love anything watermelon. Is this Haribo or Haribo? How do you pronounce that? This is so cute. It's a makeup brush cleaning mat. And it ha oh, it sticks onto your wall. Oh, mirror counter is what I was trying to say. This is a lychee sleeping mask. <gasps> some chocolate. I've never had these before. This is so fun. You guys should tag a creator you want me to swap with next. I'm trying to figure out what smells so good. We got some eye masks. I love strawberry pocky. Oh my gosh. Next we have this. It's like wrapped up. Let me unwrap it real quick. <gasps> no, you freaking didn't. Miles, it's wet. There's still so much in the box. I'm gonna have to do a part two, but it should be up right now. So I saw these at Target and they reminded me of a very small inconvenience that I have every time I do my makeup. Let me just show you. So they're these things and they stick onto your mirror. Let me just clean the mirror really quick weird there's no adhesive on them but they stick just like that like what this is how i have mine set up i'm gonna 
reenact what happens to me all the time. Disregard the fact that these are all dirty. So I go in and I use a makeup brush. It's clean. I use it. It's dirty. Put it back. I end up having to wash all of them at the end of the week because I can't remember which ones are clean or dirty, especially the darker ones. Now when I'm done using them, the dirty ones will have their own spot. I'm using the smaller ones to hold beauty blenders. And when you're done washing the brushes, boom, you hang them to dry. It gets better. This thing holds your beauty blender when you're not using it. Wow. It's like a whole system. Like, hold on, let me back up. Like, that's cute. It's the little things I do at 3 a.m. Good night. <laughs> this is so bad. I'm going to try to become that girl. But first, I need to clean and restock this room. So let's do that. I want to keep these up forever, but... <laughs> first, I'm picking up all the trash. I'm going to make two piles for makeup and skincare. Yay, now let's put it away. Now I'm going to organize my drawers and restock. Now I'm just gonna wipe everything down. Can't remember the last time I cleaned this mirror. It's pretty disgusting up here. I'm just trying to watch Love Island and I'm over here cleaning my room. Like. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that took me all day. This weekend, I'm doing a tour of this room, so if you want to see that and help me get to 100,000 subscribers, go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay. Yo, what up? I love the way I organize my makeup and skincare. It's so convenient until I have to do my everyday makeup. I basically use the same products every day, so I have to go through every single drawer just to find them. So I got these bathroom trays to put the product. Uh, this is the next day, guys. I can't go. I'm going to put the products I'm currently using on them, so I only have to go to one spot. Vanity drawer. Vanity. I don't know what to do. I'm going to try the drawer first. Starting with makeup, my favorite primer right now is this one. ColourPop Tinted Moisturizer, I'm always using these. It's gonna chill in the back, but I'm gonna put my beauty blenders in it. Fenty Contour Stick, It Cosmetics Blush. More blush by ColourPop. Benefit and NYX for my brows. I use clear mascara on my brows too. Better than sex mascara. I'm actually gonna put the smaller items in here so it looks less cluttered. Baking and translucent powder. Too Faced Lip Injection and NARS Lip Tint together. Yes. An eyelash curler. And some setting sprays. I forgot to change it to three minutes, so really quick, this is skincare. Final now everything is all in one spot and I can switch out products when I want. Part two, I got different color tape for all the boxes. This room's gonna be pink and I've already done that side so I just need this one. I have a feeling I'm gonna be here till 3 a.m. Oh well. First drawer done. This is kind of sad but I can't wait to set everything up in the new place. I'm putting all the loose lip glosses in this container. I'm so proud of myself. I got rid of a lot of palettes I don't use. These are mine and I kept a pile for my sister. One day I'll wash my makeup brushes but for now I'm throwing them in here. I'm almost done. I just need the workout drawer. Do I just skip this and start my pantry? Yes. No. Yes. No. See you in part three. I'm so excited. Look what I got in the mail. I got a PR package from Lush, so I'm going to do a haul. Let me know if you guys like PR hauls, and I will do more. This is the little note they gave me. They're so cute. There are so many things, so I'm going to go fast, starting off with the bubble bars. This is Elsie the giraffe. Strawberry foam. Apple crumble. It literally smells like an apple. Light bulb moment. The great wave. Silver lining. It's a cloud. This would look so dope in the tub. I couldn't find the name to this one. Puppy love. The honey pot. Miss Whippy. Castle in the clouds. Now we have all the ones in brown bags. This one is called Twilight. I think this is seaweed. That's cool. Matcha roll. Rainbow 2020. This is a bubble stick. It's called Mallow Drama. The rest of these are bath bombs. This one is called Dynamite. I've never seen anything like this. Frozen. Bubble and squeak? Question mark? Should we test it? Eclipse. And Ahoy. Lush! Thank you so much. I love everything. I could literally cry. Thank you. Yo, what up? This is a video I never thought I would ever make, but I'm going to show you guys my laundry routine. First, I bring the laundry basket down. Yaddy, 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 yaddy. Okay, we're at the laundry room now. I'm just going to throw the clothes in. I'm mainly doing dark clothes right now. There we go. This is all in order. I start with the detergent. My washer has a pull-out tray. For a large load like this one, I usually do a fourth of a cup of detergent. And then about a fourth of a cup of laundry booster, and I just sprinkle that all over the clothes. For the scent beads, I use a little less than fourth of a cup, and I sprinkle that all over as well. For the 
softener. I kind of just eyeball it, but it goes in this blue compartment right here. Let's see if I can, there we go. I also eyeball the laundry sanitizer, so you can give it a little one, two. I've only ever used one setting, and that's cotton normal. Whee! These are already dry from earlier, but I gotta clean the lint track. I don't know why, I just love cleaning this thing. Keep all of my dryer sheets in this box. If I did need to dry anything, I would just pick one up, throw one in, and start the dryer. I just love it in here now that it looks nice. I'm excited for this one. Everything I'm going to show you is on my Amazon page. If it's not, I will let you know where I got it from, but the link is in my bio. I'm so low on everything right now. I haven't done lashes in a few months because my focus is somewhere else, but I think I got this container at Bed Bath Beyond or Home Goods. Up here I have micro and lip applicators. I use these for so many things like adding pre-treatment or sealant or even removing the lashes. Here I keep my under eye pads. I've tried so many. These are the best ones I've found so far. For any service before I set up, I like to lay a dental bib down and then put my stuff on top and I just keep them on that bottom drawer. Spoolies, cotton swabs, and tape. If you're willing to spend a little bit more on tape, next care is so much easier to remove. Oh my gosh. And it's more comfortable for your client. I get my tiles from Home Depot. I thought these ones were so cute. I got this at Michael's. When I make my pre-made fans, I just store them in here. My Nano Mister. It's so cute. Lash shampoo that I love. This manual air blower. Honestly, I just use this fan. I know I should try other lash brands, but I just love Minky's lashes. When I practice, I keep the tiles in photo boxes. These magnifying glasses come with a light. Super helpful. If I missed anything, I'll list it in the comments. I got this tie-dye soap making kit, so I'm going to try and make some soap. Okay, it doesn't seem like it'll be too hard, so I have white soap and clear soap, molds and instructions, and some soap colorant. I'm supposed to choose one of these and cut them into one and a half inch squares. Now I'm supposed to put this in the microwave for 30 seconds. With my luck, my kitchen's probably going to explode. I'm mixing it now. As you can see, this is take two. I'm pouring it in now. Ooh, that's cool. I'm excited! This one's gonna be yellow and red. Now I'm just swirling it around. I don't know if this is gonna look good. Oh my gosh, <laughs> these are gonna look so ugly. It says to leave it here for 30 minutes, so I'm gonna go watch some Love Island. I'll be back. Time to take them out of the mold. Let's see if I can do this. Gosh, this is the last one and just won't come out. Wow, they're not that bad. I really like them. This one's my favorite. I'm gonna go to my sink and see if it stains my hands. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. Oh my god, it doesn't. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. My beauty slash filming room is basically done, so I'm going to do a mini tour. Also, I ordered this off of Amazon. It's for my room, but I can only show it to you at nighttime, so if you want to see what it is, I will post a video later tonight. This is where I do my makeup, of course, but I also film my YouTube videos here. I got the desk from Ikea, this I DIY'd, and then the chair I got from Home Goods. The neon signs are from Amazon. That I think I got at Ross as well as Lowe's. When you turn around, this is what you'll see in my YouTube videos. This is kind of like my esthetician supply closet. So over here, I have my nail cart. This basket system is so helpful. So this unit is from Target. This long one is from Ikea, as well as the basket. Back here, I have my LED lights, which I framed on my closet. And these were from Amazon. And I also have a train case. In case you do want to see what's in my drawers, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll be posting a detailed room tour, and I will try to link everything possible. This unit is from Ikea, and you can customize it, so I just got two of the biggest ones. This side is for all of my makeup. It's my side hobby, so I wanted one spot for all of it. This side holds skin, body, and hair products. And then my mirror, and I'm going to put slippers here. And that's it. Yeah. I want to scream, but I won't. I'm going to turn my hot chocolate bar into a smoothie bar. First, I got to get everything off the counter. <laughs> now I'm just spraying and wiping everything down. And we're cleaning! Yeah! Cleaning! This is the new tiered shelf I got. It's so cute. Got these cute candy jars. You can find them on Amazon. Let's fill them. I'm filling the first jar with taro powder. This one with boba. Vanilla ice cream protein powder. This one is getting filled with oats. Oh. And chia seeds. I'm putting the jars on the top shelf. I'm using another jar for dried mangoes and dried strawberries. These smell so good. These are going on the bottom shelf. This jar that I found for honey is so cute. I'm filling this one with super greens powder. I love this in my smoothies. Putting my magic bullet on the side here. I use it all the freaking time. It's so old. <laughs> this is the last cup I have. I might as well put it here. Okay. Wow. Oh my gosh. Am I in a Pinterest app? I almost forgot the scoops. Also, I wanted to say hi to all my new friends. We're almost at 4 million. Thank you so much for following me. I'm Usually I can explain. This time I can't. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Look how cute this is. I can't. I cannot. It comes apart just like the real cup. <laughs> I got two of the icy white sets because I'm planning a giveaway. I found this dark green gridded cup. It reminds me of grass. Okay, I'm just gonna go quick. <laughs> I had to get two just in case one broke. Everyone's calling this one the jeweled cup. I got it in peach and dark green. Pink and black and green water bottle. Dark green stainless steel. This is a color changing cup. I'm not sure what color it changes into, but 
both of them. Couldn't find this one in a venti, so I went with grande. Stainless steel one, as you turn it, it changes colors. Same with this one and the straw. <laughs> Try not to get grandes, but this one reminded me of candy cane. Never seen one like this before. This one is a mixture of those two put together. What? Running out of time. Those two. looks bad in a mess, but it's a sorted mess. So this is my pile, which is probably really bad, but this is for gifts and some giveaways I'm planning. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases, but for my new house. First, Hazel's new bed. It's a flower. It's so cute. I also got matching food bowls. You can take them off the stand, but I'm going to leave them. This gumball machine. I don't know. A mini portal mirror. I'm going to put this on my entryway table. Balloon dog with a balloon poop. <laughs> Bought two. Checkered blanket. It's really soft and it's going on my new couch. Steven, aka Benson, in plush four. This rug from Lonely Ghost. If you're watching this, by the way, I love you. Also, everything before this rug is on Amazon. I'll link it on my storefront. This candle from Target by Tabitha Brown. It's so beautiful and it smells amazing. Urban Outfitters cutting board. Me getting a massive cutting board out just for one orange. So this will be good. More cloud pillows from Amazon. They're so soft. This mushroom cup, also from Urban. A bubble maker and all of that. Yo, what up? I'm gonna make a last minute gift basket. Courtney's almost here. <laughs> also, I lost a nail. That's her found this box and i'm filling it with this this is so cute matching pen eye mask lip mask this stuff is so good it's like liquid chapstick these are our favorite sponges so i'm grabbing two. Oh my gosh let's keep next snacks look what i found birthday cake kisses <laughs> hey i'm back and i got a few extra things love this up book is gonna go here it's the next day um i also got starbucks so i had to figure out how to carry everything upstairs <laughs> Let's restock my fridges, that girl. First, water. Filling two of these with cucumber. This one with limon. This is so aesthetic reality. You got some trash, just dump it at my house. Next, Capri Sun. Pacific Cooler. Friggin' oatmeal. Well, this is awkward. It's turning into a pantry restock. Halloween cookies. So good. Granola. Oh my God. Do you guys like that? <laughs> these are for my refresher bar. We have blueberries, raspberries, and strawberries. Cute container for lemons. I know this is not food, but I might as well. Could go on and pretend this is all I have to restock. But there's so much more. <laughs> Hi, Hazel. Yeah, come, come. You have too many toys. It's partly my fault, but still, we need to declutter. Up, ballerina. Good girl. I got a smaller toy bin from Home Goods. Whatever I can't fit in there is gonna get donated. We're definitely keeping this elephant. Just gonna put it in there. Yeah. What about this skateboard? Are we keeping it? I'm just gonna slowly put it in there. You're literally, you have, it's not Easter anymore. Okay, can I at least have the bunny? We're getting nowhere. We're for sure keeping your Capri Sun. She's distracted. She loves this pool party toy. Oh, walked out. Like, okay. No, she loves the Baron Raccoon. Keeping Craig. Oh, welcome back, I guess. She's not really into burrow toys anymore. This one has crabs in it. It's so cute, but she doesn't play with them. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I'm just gonna take everything out. Which ice cream cone do you wanna keep? Okay, we'll keep that one. Also her favorite, so I'm keeping all of them. Keeping the sunscreen because it's cute. Yay, you did it! High five! My family makes fun of me for the way I make my orange juice, but all I do is grab some oranges. I use about five, wash them, and cut them in half. This is probably going to be one of my shortest videos, but I have my cup. <laughs> Stop looking at me! I have my cup, my orange, and then I just press down. And then I just scoop the pulp and put it back into the orange juice. Well, why don't you just eat the orange? Because I like to drink it. It just hits different. Part two, I just put these up. They're a little loose, but oh well. Now I'm putting LED lights pretty much everywhere. Starting with the sink and around the mirror. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna finish the ceiling. Starting on the shower now. I got these acrylic shelves from Amazon. They're so cute. Also found matching hooks. I'm putting them on this side to hold my loofah and razor. Back to the shelves. I forgot I got these. Okay, what? How is this my bathroom right now? Since my bathroom is pretty small, showering is even worse. So I bought a curved shower curtain rod. Hopefully it'll make it feel bigger. For my shower curtain, I was going to use this cow print one, but when I put it up, it made my bathroom look so small. So instead I'm using a clear shower curtain liner with these curtain lights. Wow, that's different. Okay, these are waterproof by the way. It's 4 a.m. by the way. That's what it looks like with the lights off. Terrible. I like it better with the white shower curtain, but the outside is one thing. The inside is a whole experience. I have so much space now. Look at me, I'm crying at 4 a.m. because I love it so much. All I have to do now is fill with product, make a DIY bath cart, fill my drawers. I'll see you in part three. Deep cleaning and redecorating my living room part two. All of this mess and this needs to be moved out. I'm going to start with the storage cubes. Oh gosh, what is in here? Oh my gosh, I think this is my stepdad's, but my brother and I would play it all the time. See, that stands for Andrew and Kelly. Can you tell I love card games? It's so cute. It's all sorted. Now I'm going to clear off the table. This was my little call center desk, and it's still so weird not seeing a computer on it. Yikes, I'm glad I'm cleaning this. This does not work anymore. I'll be using this in a different room. It totally looks like I just moved in. And there's even an echo. Cock -cock! I have five boxes of stuff I need to build to fill this area, and I can't even bring them in because they're so heavy. I'm going to be honest, it's probably going to take me all day to build them, so I will see you at 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning for part 3. You're still here. Okay, you get a little sneak peek of some more things I bought for decorations. And don't, don't mind me. It's one of those days. I'm 
I'm really proud of this one. So I found one of these knitted ball seat things and I found it for 30 bucks at Home Goods. What? I saw this and I just had to buy it. It's so cute, but I'm actually going to repaint it. Another plant. Why not? This basket is so cute. It's from Target and I'm going to use it for my blankets. But I'm spray painting a different color. I got a package from TikTok. It says refrigerate upon arrival, but it's pretty cold, so I'm just going to open it. And it says open immediately, so technically I'm following instructions. Oh my god, oh my god. I think it's a cake. I think it's a freaking... I've never been sent a cake before. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, look. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay, what do I do? Hold on. I've never seen a cake this tall. It says the bigger the slice, the bigger the surprise. So I have a butter knife because I didn't do dishes. And we're going to cut this for now. I got one side. Let's do the other side. Okay, here we go. Oh, so oh whoa! <gasps> what? So cool. I've never seen a cake like this in real life, and it's literally in my kitchen. Wow! Cool. Thank you, TikTok. Thank you so much, and Happy New Year. 2022, I'm coming back. I'm still trying to become that girl. My style is next, but first I'm going to make an aesthetic clothing rack. Blah, I can't talk today. Okay, I'm almost done. I just need this side, but what are those extra screws for? so cute i found them on walmart's website at 3 a.m they're led signs but i'm gonna use them as hangers i'm also gonna use normal ones in white wow i love it so much now i'm gonna add some of my favorite clothes just kidding i don't have any favorite clothes just these shoes and this sweatshirt i got two days ago it's so cute yeah i want to dress cute but i don't know how to so if you guys want to help me comment your favorite clothing brand next step i'm gonna be doing some clothing try on hauls once i get some stuff in so yeah wish me luck just in case the rack is on my amazon storefront these are from pretty little thing that's from white fox those hangers are from target and those are from walmart so excited i'm making a whole bunch i hope i got enough corn syrup to fill those first honey this feels so wrong corn syrup in tic tacs can't remember why i was pouring that into a bowl i'm gonna store them upside down so i don't use as much ready love island do you see it with the heart found these white pearls i'm pretty excited for them pink and purple light blue and dark blue this one is a pink sanding sugar it's so pretty purple holiday one because it's close enough this one's my favorite so messy they don't look edible but they're really pretty let's freeze them i heard it takes five hours let's speed that up i can't get over how pretty they are okay i'll be back i'm not ready for the mouth noises i'm probably gonna throw my phone at the wall multiple times editing this video i'm doing frozen honey first this one kind of looks like styrofoam i feel like i did something wrong it doesn't really taste like anything maybe the tic tac one will <laughs> my hair bye the love island one maybe okay it's obviously not gonna taste like anything but yeah. oh <laughs> uh -uh. why did i think these were gonna be sweet um let me know if you want a part two trying the rest of these i'm still trying to become that girl and i can't be that girl without an aesthetic mirror so i'm gonna paint mine first i'm taping it it's supposed to look like a portal so i'm doing three sections first section will be pale blue it's not going back now okay that's cute that's actually cute Wait yeah next dark blue i'm gonna try to aesthetically paint this for you guys it's not working out i give up no I don't. now i'm peeling the tape off um i don't think i did this right it's peeling off because i didn't prep it right what about a nice ombre i'm gonna peel all the paint off and try this again maybe not the same design I can't wait to see you in part two and yes it is 3 a.m up i'm doing a giveaway the first prize is vacation theme the second one is self-care for the vacation one i got you this starbucks cup and water bottle pineapple tree hut scrub it smells so good this travel set and this one i really want one now my favorite palette my favorite candle pina colada sunscreen cleanser vacation to me smells like this lotion so i had to put it in lip injection liquid bronzer lip balm more lip balm waterproof mascara a cute makeup bag we're twins because i bought myself some too. pineapple squishmallow lastly a starbucks gift card now i'm doing self-care i got you this starbucks cup and water bottle lavender scrub this one's my favorite tatcha cleansing and hydrating kit my favorite eye patches and eye cream when I light this candle, I feel so motivated. It's actually scary, but that's why I love it. Face roller, Laneige lip mask, a hair mask, lotion, cleanser, and moisturizer, glow recipe mist, lip balm, and all of this. Sorry, I'm running out of time. This giveaway is being held on my Instagram. The rules to enter will be in the caption of my most recent post. Good luck. Yo, what up? I'm going to try and make a giant advent calendar for my sister and niece. Wish me luck. Boxes in the middle and then bags on the side. Now that I have the layout, I'm going to decorate them and then fill them. I'm going to start with my nieces. I'm sticking these lollipop things to the back of the poster board. Okay, yes. And that's my sister's. So cute. Now I'm taking these ornaments and hanging them on the side. I wrote 1 through 12 in silver sharpie and now I'm sticking them onto the bags. I added some bows too. Oh my gosh. Time to fill up. My niece loves turtles. So day one is a turtle ornament. And my sister gets a microphone because she loves to sing. Candy canes for day two. Day three, I'm doing bath bombs and a snowman. Oh my gosh. Day four, I found these wallet lanyard things, but there's an extra pouch for extra stuff. I don't know. Day five, a beauty sponge. Day six, these candles. They smell so good. I'm gonna have to put extra tape on the bags, though. Chapstick for day seven. Found these really cute hair ties for day eight. And some makeup removing towels for day nine. I'm excited for day ten. It's gel pens. Day eleven is an Oreo house, but I'm trying to wrap it. And necklaces for day twelve. <gasps> Part two, let's take it out of the fridge. Ah, I'm so excited! Also, in 
part one, I told you to use four packets. I don't know why I said that. I meant four packets from two boxes. So eight total, don't forget. All right, I have my cutting board. I'm gonna cut it straight in the middle. This is what it looks like cut in half. I'm gonna cut it one more time. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. Pff, I'm a little dramatic. Now you know how to make watermelon fruit slices. Let's try it. These are so cool. They're frozen in time. No, jelloed in time. Oh. Okay, here we go. What? What? This is so good! You know what? For me, it needs more sugar. Maybe put some vanilla extract in the mixture, but you need a little bit more of something sweet. But other than that, it's good. Mmm. Also, what is going on? Last night I had 3.1 million friends. Now I have 3.2 million friends. Oh my god! Hello, thank you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Grab some Oreos. This time you'll need about 37. Crush them in a food processor. Bye. Or a Ziploc bag. It should look something like this. Measure out about a cup and put it into a separate bowl. Treat those to the side. <gasps> Yikes, grab six tablespoons of butter. Hi, BB. Can someone come clean my fridge? Put it in the microwave until it's melted. Oh, my camera's dirty. <gasps> wow, that was terrible. Add the butter to the bigger bowl of Oreo. It should look like uh, wet dirt when you pat it down. Grab some liners and line your cupcake pan. Add in about one tablespoon of the mixture to each liner. Now pack them down as hard as you can. Preheat your oven to 350. Bake for five minutes and then take them out. Grab that same bowl, 16 ounces of cream cheese. <laughs> Add in one fourth cup of sugar, a splash of vanilla extract, that was too much, and two eggs, then whisk everything together. Once it looks like this, add in your leftover cup of Oreos. This mixture should look like cookies and cream. I film my videos in real time and I have to let this sit overnight, so I'll see you tomorrow in part two. Bye! I chose green and white this year. I think my mom is gonna freaking love it. Here's her basket. I'm gonna show you how I fill it. The basket is from Home Goods, and then I tied ribbon around it. First, I'm filling it with air pockets and paper so I can position everything nicely. Putting green and white tissue paper in the back, I'm gonna start with the taller items. I found this at Target for $5. My plan is to put it in the back as decoration. This is what I have so far. I got her a bottle and a cup with a gift card in it and her loofah set. Some more of these, and I'm gonna put her onto my favorite micellar water. She didn't even know. Caffeine solution thumbnail, a jade roller, coconut lime sugar scrub, this beauty pillowcase, a really cute bracelet, and some lotion. My mom hates her tweezers and she always forgets to buy them when she's out so I just got hers up. <laughs> this really pretty palette and my mom's hair is dirty blonde. Isn't she gonna look so cute in this hair tie? How cute is this card? Target, run. It came out so cute. I'm also doing rose petals around the gift. <laughs> I'm hoping this helps with gift ideas in case you were looking for some. And siblings, if you're watching this, don't show this to mom. Grab a bowl. You'll need one cup of chocolate chips and about a fourth of a cup of peanut butter. Mix it. I'm not trying to make anything gourmet, so we're gonna use the microwave. Mix every 15 seconds until it's melted. I'll grab a pan and line it with parchment paper and pour the chocolate in. This one is a seven by 11. Spread that evenly and freeze it for about 20 minutes. Grab another bowl. Add in one cup of powdered sugar, one cup of marshmallow fluff, Oh my God. And one fourth cup of peanut butter. Mix it. I just used my hands and it should feel like dough when you're done. Put it on top of the first layer and even it out. Now take some peanuts and layer that on top and gently press them in. Set that aside and grab about a cup of soft caramel. Melt it in your microwave and mix every 15 seconds. Once it's melted, spread it on top as fast as you can and then push it in. The last layer is the same as the first one. One cup of chocolate chips, one fourth cup peanut butter and melt it. Whee! Okay, almost almost dropped that put it in your freezer for 20 minutes cut them up and now you know how to make homemade snickers let's try them okay here we go i have a lot to do today oh well let's play what's your side okay taurus your daughter will move out Yikes. after you've ignored all the warning signs y'all need to fix that oh this one just jumped at me pisces you'll get a standing ovation i'm a pisces but it won't stop you from moving to la Interesting. Scorpio, your neighbor will show up unannounced. Could be a good thing, could be creepy, which sends you right back to therapy. What? These are juicy. Aquarius, everything will go as planned. Aww. But you still won't be satisfied. Oh my. Leo, it's time to be honest with your therapist. And it will fill a void you didn't even know existed. These are getting a little serious. Let me know if you guys like these and I'll do a part two. Part two of the mystery box, we got a whole bunch of Lush. This smells so citrusy, I love it. This is the Twilight bath bomb. A comforter bath bomb. Don't want TikTok to take the video down, so that's what this one is called. I think the flower, like, pops up when you put it in the water. Okay, I've got my video taken down for making brownies. Like, I can see where that's, like, 
questionable, but still. Look how cute this fanny pack is. We got some gummy bears. I love to put tahine and chamoy on these. Nutella, baby. I love Nutella. More dark chocolate, and it's pomegranate flavored. Some Oreos. What? Most stuffed? These exist? Oh my gosh when i was little i would take out the stuffing put it in a ziploc bag and give the cookies to my siblings and eat the stuffing next we have some pins i'm all that in dim so that's so cute a gummy burger what and this headband it's so soft miles thank you so so much for everything i'm gonna go run a bath right now and put on my eye mask spring cleaning even though it's not spring the bathroom i'm gonna start by taking everything out of the bathroom <laughs> Every December, I like to declutter everything I have so I can have a fresh start for the New Year. So, what I'm basically saying is, this is going to be a series so that you can do this too. Yay! Woo! Whoa! And have a seat. Now that everything is out and the shower is rinsed, I'm going to start by scrubbing it. Clean out this drawer, I'm putting everything in a separate bucket. And I'm gonna declutter this at the end. I did the same thing with the bottom drawer and under the sink. Now I'm just spraying the drawers and I'm gonna wipe them down. Same thing with the counters, I'm gonna let this sit and Windex the mirrors first. Mama hit me with a chicken wing. Okay, I'm tired of this hair. It's two in the morning, I work in four hours. Hi, it's the next day and I just got off of work. Next I gotta clean the toilets. I'm gonna wipe down the baseboards because they're kinda gross. Lastly, I'm cleaning the floors with a Swiffer. Wow. Now that the bathroom's super clean, I'm gonna redecorate this with all the new winter stuff I bought, so I'm gonna go film that real quick. I'm also gonna show you how I organize these cleaning my cleaning closet part two. I have to go to the kitchen. So I normally use these cleaners, but I'm gonna wait till they're empty, and I saw these glass spray bottles, and I'm gonna try and make homemade cleaner. In case I don't like it, comment down below your favorite cleaners or recipes you think I should try. But for now, I might as well be cute while I have them. If you just wanna do this and skip the homemade recipes, most containers will tell you if you have to store it in its original container. With what I read on my other cleaners, these are the only two I'm putting in glass bottles. I'm labeling them with this and a paint marker. These are so cute! Also, I saw that a lot of people wanted to know how my hand was doing. I just want to say thank you. I feel so loved and cared for. My hand is doing so much better. I'm almost able to make a full fist, and it's getting better every day. These bins are from Ikea. I'm putting Swiffer pads in this one. I almost forgot I got these command hooks. You stick them to your wall, and you can hang your broom or mop on them. My cleaning cloths are going in this basket. I'm putting the cleaners I use the most on the first shelf. The rest of them are going under here and under my sink. This is so cute. I'm adding a fake plant on the side. This basket for Hazel's clothes and that one for random things. Oh my gosh, it looks so good in here! I'm sleeping in the closet. Good I'm gonna reset my whole bathroom. Well, I'm gonna try. I'm turning it into a glow spot. First, I'm taking everything out. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I wasn't ready for this bucket. <laughs> new year, new me. Right? Do this. <laughs> Stop. Now it's time for the aesthetic part of the video. It is so echoey in here. Okay, this spray is broken. I'm trying to make this look aesthetic, but it's not working out. That took me 10 hours. That is not okay. But at least I'm done. Kind of. I still have the decor. Got a new shower head, by the way. This is not it. It's this one. I'm so excited because it has mist. But anyways, this is everything I'm going to decorate with. So I'll see you in part two. I'm still trying to become that girl. So I'm starting a bullet journal. I'm going to decorate the outside first with these stickers I made. Hold on. Wait a minute. That was so cute. I feel like I need more, though. I have a really good idea for the first page. Also, I almost paid $25 for a six-pack of these markers when I found this 120-pack for $36 on Amazon. Please. It'll all be on my Amazon page in my BIO. Skipped a few pages for the index. I'll do that later. I've always wanted a follower tracker. I'm adding in some cow print. Not sure if it's going to look good, but... Gosh, I messed it up. I don't even have white out. Anyways, I hit 6.2 today. Thank you, guys. So we get to fill that in together. Kind of ugly, but I'll get better. I have a lot more pages I want to fill out, so I can do a part two or I can move on to the next that girl video let me know. i'm getting my nails done again this is what i'm asking for or these i can't decide so here's the before just wait for it why do they always just break off i have never wanted to cry coming out of a nail salon first of all they were so rude to me second of all this is how they left me just i mean some of the nails are okay but there's fuzzies and every nail you can kind of see it on this one it's fine, but look how bumpy the rest of them are. They're literally bumpy. They kept burning me with the drill, and it took a total of three hours. One of them was me waiting in the waiting area. My choice, it's fine, but to top it off, I have gel top coat. You can see it right there, kind of all over my hands, like all over. Okay, I just got back. They said they would redo it for me. Oh, I don't know what I did. Like, I don't know why they're just being so rude to me, but I don't know if I should go back because I just feel so uncomfortable. Like, oh, what do I do? I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. Some of you may know I work at a call center. I quit my freaking job. I quit my freaking job. I'm unemployed. Here's my equipment. I'm about to turn it in. I'm going to put these on one last time. I quit my job. 
I know. I'm going to do my call center voice one last time. <clears throat> Hi, thank you for calling blah blah blah. My name is Kelly. Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? What's that? You're being rude for no reason? And you're attacking me personally? Ba 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 ba. All seriousness, this is probably one of the best jobs I've ever had. I made so many good friends. If you're watching this, by the way, I'm gonna miss you so much and good luck because some of those customers are just bad, just crazy. Oh my god, like all I've ever known was working for somebody. Like, I did not think in a million years I'd be able to like work myself and have like the biggest support system. Hold on, let me compose myself. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kelly and I work social media full time now. This is all because of you, so thank you so much for making my dreams come true. Yo, what up? I messed up! I forgot to get the stuff I needed to finish painting my room and I can't do part four until tomorrow. So I hope this will hold you over until I can do part four. I'm gonna try Nair for the first time. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little patch chest because I'm not trying to get burned. Let's go to my bathroom. So the directions say I need a damp washcloth or sponge. And I've got three just in case. Sorry, my back's itchy. <laughs> I just hold the phone. Okay, here we go. I'm so scared. It says to spread it evenly. So I'm so scared right now. Oh my god. Let's see if it worked. Ooh, okay. Personally, I don't like it. Because it ended up leaving blotches of hair no matter how long I left it on for. So I'm just gonna stick to waxing and shaving. I'm gonna try to become that girl, but I need cute petting to do so. So we have Tarja. White or sage green? I have a dog and I eat in bed most weekends. Cry mascara. We're gonna go see it. My style is next because I need help. I'm also getting this pillow because I have one on my couch and it's really comfy. White pillowcases, lunch bowls, and y'all already know. I'm taking two of these. I hate going outside. Can't be that girl without a cute camera, so we're at home goods. Let's see if you have psychic abilities. <gasps> I think I'm gonna do two of these. I'm just kidding. I'm back. This is my situation. It's giving echo, it's giving live, laugh, love, it's giving monotone. <laughs> I'm gonna paint new pictures for my room tomorrow, but for now. Hey, gleamy. Oh, <laughs> white sheets, white duvet cover. throwing the pillows on and adding the butts look at this masterpiece tell me why this was at the back of the shelf like we don't get enough attention as it is got these glow bar things from the checkout lines let's see if they work wait what ten dollars at home goods it's so worth it almost done just adding a laptop notepads and pens because that girl is productive shiba inu yay i'm done i'll figure out the wall situation later but yay i'm done this is what it looks like during the day and night it's so cute <laughs> like i'm just kidding next step an aesthetic nighttime routine I'm gonna try to make an aesthetic wreath or just a wreath. What is this even called? I don't even, anyway. So first I need to figure out how to get it on, like stuck onto here. Just finished tying the gorland around the middle part. Now I need to do the outside. Now I'm gonna spray it with fake snow. <gasps> I'm actually gonna put the pine cones on first. Okay, just trust the process. I'm gonna, now I'm gonna put the ornaments on. I went with gray, clear and gray. Bought a bunch of hooks for nothing. It's so much easier to just tie them onto the pine needle thing. <laughs> okay, let's hang it up. It's not even for my front door. It is for my room. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love it. So you walk in like yo what up i'm gonna use my glow spot one last time before i pack it and show you my shave routine i'm gonna miss this so much but the new one's gonna be a lot better let's do watermelon first i exfoliate using any tree hub body scrub this one's watermelon it smells so good i have really dry skin and this scrub does the best job at removing it so i just take some on this glove and do circle motions and i love how glowy and soft i feel after using it now i'm gonna use tree hub's watermelon shave oil love this one because it doesn't irritate my skin while i shave i do like two or three pumps i always get the closest shave and it's really hydrating so everyone in here lastly i use the watermelon whipped shea butter Mm -hmm. it smells so good. Super hydrating, lightweight, and not greasy, which I love. And that's it. Time to pack it up. I can't wait to show you my new glow spot. Okay, bye. Getting my nails done. I can't decide between this one or this one. This is the closest I'll get to a bee theme because I'm actually pretty afraid of them. So, or this one. Ah! Well, that didn't go well. Here they are, I guess. Okay, well, long story short, I'm going to try and fix them myself. Update, I went somewhere else. The nail tech was like, who did your nails? Because there was extra acrylic all along my nail. It was so bad. I just went with what I had before. I just want one set person to go to Severe Nail Tech. DM me. Why do I shop at 3 a.m.? Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. This one's good though. Right now my collection is hidden behind these cabinets. So I got these clear floating wall shelves. A whole bunch of them. So I can display them. Ah. I'm also putting neon lights on these. It's going to be so cute. The lighting is so bad in here. Okay, so this is the wall and I already put a shelf up. Oh, I'm so sad. Long story short, I can't put up the rest of the shelves. Plan B, I got this at Lowe's for $30. Yes, but it did take me three hours to build. So hopefully this works. gosh it's so cute don't mind the holes in the wall i gotta patch them i'm gonna throw all my cups on here so i can get an idea of what it's gonna look like 
can't wait to sort everything. I'm probably gonna color code and my lights will be here in about a day or two. So I will see you in part two. Oh my God. It's hot. I'm gonna try some of your favorite drinks at Starbucks. Please be good. Hi, can I please get a cup of cream cold foam and caramel please? Sorry, um, those cars behind you, I heard literally- A cream cold foam and caramel please. Yes, please. Thank you. Um, yes, please. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. It's gonna be so freaking awkward. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Eleanor, let's give this a try. Mmm, so good. Hi, can I get a grande dragon fruit refresher with sweet? So unfortunately, uh, we're all out of our dragon fruit. Oh! Do you all the other refreshers still? To order this instead oh lily i didn't even know this existed okay here we go Aww, this is so good. redecorating my living room part three this is how i spent my last two days building this tv stand and the tv is mounted to the wall we're getting somewhere I just organized most of the cables in this drawer and i ordered some stuff from amazon to hide these ones it's so cold out here now i'm gonna spray paint the basket i got from target Okay, I'm gonna let that dry. I was gonna wait to do this, but I can't. I'm just gonna reveal the couch and we're gonna decorate it. Yikes, this place is a disaster because of this project, so sorry you have to see that. It took me a while to find the right couch because I wanted a specific color and size because I'm picky, but I finally found it and I got it at Costco and this is Hazel's new spot. I've always wanted an ottoman this big. It's basically a giant dog bed. Okay, I don't think this is gonna look good until I clean the rest of my house, but oh well. I thought this blanket was so cute. It's from Target. This pillow is from Target as well. It's from their bedding section. Can you believe I found these at Walmart? What? This is what I came up with and I don't like it as much as I thought I would. I think it's way too plain and it needs pattern or color or something, but I'll come back to the couch later. I'm gonna start working on the two sides, the wall and the ceiling. I will see you in part four. Yo, what up? Part two of my at-home waxing setup. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel because I'm gonna be hosting a video this week about all things waxing, so if you're interested in that, you'll love that video. Part one was all about the waxes. Let me show you the supplies. I keep a big bottle of hand sanitizer here, and then up here I have my barbicide wipes and my liquid barbicide. I use the barbicide wipes to disinfect anything that I touch, basically, like the bottles, any surface areas, and then I use the liquid barbicide to disinfect my tools. Everything here I got from Amazon besides the mini drawers. I got those from Bed Bath & Beyond. In this container I keep my lint-free cotton pads. And then I have my pre-cleanser, my wax remover oil, aloe vera gel, and lotion. After an eyebrow wax, I like to put Maybelline's Great Lash Clear Mascara on. I love using this on my eyebrows. It makes them look so fresh and dewy. And then I just have my tweezers and scissors. One day I will replace these with tweezer men because I think they're the best and they work so good. And here I just have my waxing sticks and strips, which I just organize in here. My bigger body waxing strips are in this photo keeper. And here I keep small, medium, and large. And I do the same thing with the sticks. I store everything here. Why does it have to be like this? I finally found pickled garlic. Oh my gosh. Whoa, dude. You just get used to the smell after a while. Ay, ay, ay. Please be good. Please. Chili powder. It kind of looks like pasta. And time. Maybe some more sriracha. Oh my. I think it's ready. I don't know, dude. Oh, come on. Okay. Here we go. I have to restock random things around my house. Starting with scent beads. You guys talk me out of getting another dog. I really want Hazel to have a little sister. But still, talk me out of it. More laundry stuff. Cereal. Moment of truth. <gasps> Whoa, that's cool. Next, my bathroom drawer. That's pretty much it. Next, I'm organizing and restocking my car. It's so bad. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try to make a coffee candle. Don't know what I'm doing, but I've been winging it my whole life and it's gotten me this far. So that's what I'm gonna do. First, I'm making the caramel drizzle, so I'm melting some wax for that. I'm heating up the jar and Hazel's going crazy. Now I'm just adding in a few drops of this candle wax dye and a few drops of this caramel latte scent. I'm waiting for this to cool down a little bit and my plan is to put it in this piping bag. <laughs> it worked, it actually worked. I'm using clear gel wax as my ice. Now I'm making the coffee. Here goes nothing, I'm trying to make a creamy brown color. I'm so excited, my place is gonna smell like coffee all the time. I'm so scared, I don't wanna mess this up. Here we go. Oh my gosh, there we go. Oh my gosh. 
<laughs> it's so cute. Now let's make the whipped cream. I broke up a whole bunch of tea light candles and I'm gonna melt them in the microwave. Now I'm just whisking it and then I'm gonna put it in this piping bag. Okay, it kind of looks like whipped cream. Oh my god. Wow, it looks so real. It smells so good. It's so cute. I'm going apple picking with my family. So let's get ready for it. First, Starbucks. Instead of my usual refresher, I'm gonna try the apple crisp macchiato. Mm, that's good. Here's my apple basket. I'm gonna bring a picnic blanket, some water, snacks, and some hand wipes I just put in this. Almost forgot a portable charger. We're gonna be taking lots of pictures and videos. Okay, I think I'm ready. I'm so excited. We are out here and it is beautiful. It's so cold and I lost a nail, RIP, but I got apples, so it's all good. <laughs> Starbucks followed me. Of course, I'm going to celebrate at Starbucks. I'm getting my favorite drink, a new drink to try, and my least favorite drink. Hi, can I please get a very, very hibiscus with extra scoops of berries, please? And then can I get a venti pink drink with salted cream foam on top? Matcha green tea latte with soy milk, please? A matcha green tea. I meant to say salted cream cold foam. I'm so awkward. I hate ordering. I always forget my lines. The car in front of me paid for me. So nice. So I paid for the person behind me. It was like 20 bucks, but I don't care. This is my favorite drink. Very bare hibiscus. Extra scoops of berries. Ah, I love it. This is beautiful. Okay, so this is the pink drink with salted cream cold foam on top. Let's try it. Wait, this is bomb. This is 100% my new favorite drink. This one, I'm not even going to take a drink of. I'm just going to give it to my BF. It's his favorite drink. It just tastes like grass to me. I just can't do it. Part three, I have an idea. What if I turn my glow spot closet into a mini store slash pop-up shop? So that's what we're doing. First, I'm going to show you what I got. Also, I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. What do I do? I found these smiley face bath bombs at Lush. I almost KO'd when I saw them, but just wait. Also had sad faces. Now I can properly take a sad bath. Also found these cloud ones. This one's really cool. You can actually open it and there's stuff inside. Like, what is that? Candy cane bubble bar and this ghost. Checkered bar soap. Apparently, Play-Doh soap is a thing. So, yeah. I got that. This is a gift. This is for me, of course. I want to try it out, too. Last thing from Lush are these. You pour it in your hand in the shower and it's body scrub, basically. These are from Target. They're shower steamers. This one smells like Fruit Loops. Can someone run to Target and tell me I'm wrong? Like, is my nose broken? I smell Fruit Loops. These are always sold out. Mini tree hug body scrub and I got the bigger one. Lollipop soap and these jars to put everything in. I'm gonna go start organizing everything. I'll be right back. Fall cleaning part. I don't even know anymore. The closet. Your discretion advised. Hey, yeah! <laughs> this is horrible! <laughs> First, I'm going to start by taking everything out of the closet. I cleared my office space, so everything is temporarily going here, on the floor. I'm starting with the floor first. Sorry if you see anything embarrassing. Everybody has chonies, okay? This will be load number five. The floor's done. Now I have to take out all of this stuff. But first, I'm going to do a load of laundry. I use a fourth of a cup of detergent and put it into this little compartment. Next, I use the blue downy and put it into here. Cheers. I don't even know why I said that. Next, I use these scent booster beads and I sprinkle them all over. Laundry booster. I know it's a lot, but this is how I get my clothes to smell so good. And lastly, some laundry sanitizer. I wish I had one of those fancy washing dryers, the ones with like the touch screen, but this will do. This is great. This does the job. Back to the closet. I'm going to start with the top section. <laughs> <sighs> I am over it. Period. This shelf is now cleared. There we go. <sighs> I knew this was going to take a while. I'll be back late again let's hurry and pack my little sister's birthday gift i do a theme every year this one is neon and musical theater the first bag i got her a playbill puzzle a broadway tote bag and some broadway socks in this bag some eyeshadow palettes i found a playbill charm bracelet on amazon and this hamilton necklace it says not throwing away my shot pop it and some earrings next bag a yellow water bottle this cute yellow wallet and a note because there's something inside a yellow pop it and her favorite gum thought this would be so cute to hold her jewelry it actually goes in this bag for the last bag i got her one of these things i don't know. neon wire lights to decorate her room pizza pop it and some icebreakers just ran Random stuff. And some more random stuff. She likes to practice acting at home, so I thought props at her. Light blue for the tissue paper, and then I made this card. Now I'm gonna go get balloons. I'm back. She loved everything. Part two, the LED lights have arrived. I was like, why are you so obsessed with me? I'm putting all of the cups on this table because I gotta flip that upside down. Just kidding. I'm just gonna put them behind these two things. Okay, I'm at the bottom of the other side. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Now I have to figure out, do I color code? Do I go by type? Okay, but where does this one go? Blue, green, or pink, purple, because of the red. It's gonna have its own section. This one can go anywhere, but I'm gonna put it here because that looks good. Now I'm switching up where they are. I'm doing black on top, then blue, pink, and purple. As I get more cups, I think the last two shelves will look a lot better. Oh my gosh, guys, it's so freaking oh my gosh. I don't know what that was, but oh my gosh, ta-da! It looks so good with my god, oh my This is just casually in my living room. This is off. This is on. You know what song is playing in my head right now? No, 
never thought I'd be eating a tomato like this. <laughs> Mini peppers. Mm. I hope these aren't hot. Hazel with her squeaky toy. Okay. Maybe they all taste the same and they're different colors like Fruit Loops. Strawberry cream cheese with graham crackers. I'm excited for this one because it looks like it's going to be good and hopefully it is. Okay, here we go. I try not to open this door to avoid what's inside. Yeah. Reorganizing my cleaning closet. I'm going to start by taking everything out. I'm debating whether I should DIY Hazel a mini closet. She has so many clothes. Look at you waiting. She loves when I take them out. The first shelf is done. I'm so glad I'm doing this. And why do I have pillows in here? Okay, wow. I just got to grab this now. Whoop. I'm taking this out and I'm going to use it in a different space. I can't wait to show you what I got instead. I got these two cube organizers. I already built one. I'm going to hurry and build the second one. One more screw. First one's going in like this. I put the second one on top and I secured them together so they wouldn't move. Yeah, my Ikea was out of stock, but Target definitely came through. This is exactly what I wanted, minus the little space in the middle. Now I have to put everything back in and organize it. I'm also going to be decorating, so I will see you tomorrow for part two. <laughs> I cannot believe what came in the mail today. Too Faced sent me a gift. Too Faced! I can't stop smiling, I don't understand. Too Faced is one of my favorite makeup brands. You guys already know I use the Better Than Sex Mascara and the Lip Injection Lip Gloss every time I do my makeup. So let's see what's inside. I haven't opened it yet because I wanted you guys to see a raw reaction. So here we go. Oh, oh my God. What? Is this the whole? Is this the whole line? Oh my gosh. I didn't even know they made eyelashes. What? Whoa, dude. Yeah, yes, literally. Where is it? Mine is almost out. Oh my god. I don't mean to cry, but this is just so nice. Wow. And these were on the side of the box. Thank you so much, Too Faced. This is the best gift ever. Resetting my entire house part four, I got a desk. What? Way better than my bed. I'm gonna be so productive. Since I have no drawers, I got these from Target, and I'm gonna use them to organize everything. Let's enjoy this ASMR by Honey Papa. gonna hold highlighters, gel pens, last one is for editing, it's gonna hold batteries, SD cards, headphones, so I just put my desk in this room, now I'm gonna decorate the wall, the lighting is so bad in here, but it's so cute so far, and I put that up, fast forward, I added lights, I stacked these two, because I thought it would look better, and now I'm adding a plan, I usually have my to-do list on my phone, but I thought this was so cute, I got it off Amazon, that's going right there, lastly, an ice cream candle, I'm gonna be so productive, hopefully, next up, I'm restocking my mini fridge, Yo, what up? I got two packages from TikTok. Oh my god. Bottom one is kind of heavy, so I'm gonna open the top one first. I'm so excited. This is so cute! Oh my gosh! This is so cute! Okay, I'm gonna read the card. So they sent gifts and products from Latinx owned brands to show appreciation and celebration of Latinx creators. Thank you so much, TikTok. I'm gonna FaceTime my mom and be like, I got the junk out. Shirt, a hat, some stickers and tattoos, and then this box. Whoa. Whoa, that is really cool. This one was so good. I'm scared to open this one. <laughs> I'm sorry. Remain calm, Kelly. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. This is so sweet. Very thoughtful. I feel so supported. We have some bum bum cream, some coffee, this cute tote bag, and I cannot wait to try these hair care products, and this candle smells amazing, and we got some good chips. Thank you, TikTok. Spring cleaning, even though it's not spring, the bathroom part two. Woo, it's time to decorate. I just picked out the ornaments I want to use. I'm going to use what's left for a future DIY video. I chose the glitter ones. I'm putting hooks on them and setting them to the side. I'm just keeping the same shower curtain because I like that it's white and I'm hooking the ornaments onto the rings. As I'm putting these up, I realized I forgot to change out the hooks, so they're just going to stay blue. I just hung this up. It is temporary. The one I actually ordered hasn't come yet. Oops, but I kind of like it. For the main towels, I decided to go with a dark gray. And then I got this hand towel set that has snowflakes on them. I just folded them over like that. I think it looks super cute. Cute. I made this glitter pine cone decoration. I'm putting that on top of the toilet. For the towel ring, I did white with a gray snowflake towel. At the top of the sink, I'm adding this candle, this frosted cranberry soap, and this lotion dispenser. I'm also going to try this toilet bowl light. I don't know how I feel about it, but here we go. Oh, that's cool. I've never had memory foam bath rugs. These were like five bucks at Home Goods, but I am obsessed now. Wow. Ah, I love the way this turned out. It is so cute. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you in episode two.